and it don't matter. I said, I absolutely don't care. If you'd have told me it were a sheep before you turned them fucking lights on, it would have saved us all sorts of... Hello? <laughs> Hello? What? Forget about... I, they didn't hear that, did they? They just said about turning the lights on. No, they heard it. What's the difference between light and hard? You can sleep with the light on. <laughs> I think that was the first naughty joke I ever got told at school was that. Oh dear. By my, <laughs> by my French teacher, Mrs Pickles. Hello. Evening. I, d I don't even know if we're on or not. I think we're on, aren't we? I don't know. I don't know. I think we are. There's a big red light flashing and it's not the one in my window, so I think we might be all right. <laughs> Hello. Oh, look, so all, of the, all these people. Uh, Mark, hi. Uh, Mark's moving to Scotland this weekend. In part due to my inspiration. Really? Yeah, I think the other part is like the, the, the kind of prison kind of the you know prison? I mean? Yeah. It's like the only place they had, wasn't it, at the other prison. <laughs> oh look, really. somebody we haven't seen for ages. Aaron's on. Aaron. Oh yeah, hello Aaron. Hello. Hello everybody, by the way. Look, Sean's advertising. <laughs> it's just, are you alright? You're a bit out of breath, aren't you, well, tonight? I've been we... running around like an idiot. First T-shirt I had on had stains all over it. That was 60 seconds ago. Is that why you're out of breath? <laughs> yeah. Because of the stains that are on it. <laughs> no. Hey. Running round. Well, running round used to get you out of breath, but as you've got older, other things get you out of breath, don't they? <laughs> yeah, just yeah. sitting up. Having, yeah, making, <laughs> making stains, opening drawers, yeah. <laughs> putting kettle on. You have to have a sit down after you put kettle on, don't you? Yeah. <sighs> oh, them, them bloody tea bags. <sighs> yeah, I know. Hello, anyway. Hello. Sorry. Uh, hello, Aaron. Uh, Struth Roof, evening all. She needs to pop out so she'll miss the start. So she'll catch us in a. Shall we, shall we wait for her? Let's wait. No, let's not. No. Uh, Goldie644. Hello. That sounds like a, a sign from Chips, doesn't it? California Highway Patrol. Hello, Does Go it? Goldie644. <laughs> this is whatever it is. <laughs> I don't know, Big Mama Bear, over and out or something. Uh, Simon Biggs is saying evening to his favourite couple. Who's that then? I don't know. Are they on here? I don't know. Are they chatting? I don't know. You think it might be the other YouTube channel? No. Couple. <laughs> you think it? No, I don't think it would be, would it? Uh, uh, I, Louis the Travel Spotter says, uh, Yay, Colin and Sean, can't wait for the live again. There you go. You don't have to wait any longer. We're on. Uh, James says, uh, I hope Sean's knees are getting better. They are getting better. I'm still walking around like I've got a wooden leg. <laughs> I thought you were going to say third leg then. Third leg? Because <laughs> you are walking around like you've got a third leg. Oh, I keep tripping over it. Yeah. <laughs> that knee support's good though, isn't it? Because you can kind of just tuck it in there now. Uh, Strangles it a bit. The boy's back in town. Hello, Brian Harper. I had a teacher called Mr. Harper. Did I, you? I've got a feeling he was called Brian. That's not you, is it? I can't see. I, I don't Are you from Cass? I don't know. Let me put my specs on. No, that's not him. He had a moustache, did Mrs. Harper, that I knew. Uh, here she is. Look, I love that. You can you spot that thumbnail a mile away, don't you? You do, yeah. Uh, I hope oh, they have drinks flowing. Uh, well, well, I'm on water tonight. Uh, fruit cider, and I've only got this one. I might have to have a whiskey afterwards. Oh, I could actually write eat, drink a Disserano now. I'm, I'm bored with that water already. I'll get you one in a bit. She's still excited, look. Still chat. Shut up. <laughs> uh, Sharon Bamber, evening. Hello. Hello. Uh, we have a buzz. Right, shut up. We do have a buzz. Right, just bear with me one second. I can't hear it. Still hear a buzz. I can still hear. I can still hear that. And when I shut up, it still does it. I can't even hear you talking. Mm. I'm just going to reset a couple of things. Bear with us one sec.
Told you I'd fix it. It's because I've got this crappy old microphone. There you, you go. You mean crappy? It cost yeah, a fortune. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Buy a new one. I know. I'm just, I'm just, I'm, 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 I'm kind of scanning past all the ones that are moaning about the sound now. Uh, Leanne says some of us can read lips. <laughs> I heard she talking about them lips. I hope so. Yeah, not the old beefy one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> what? You thought I, gonna... I just thought of Benidorm for a second. You thought I was going to say beef curtains. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not allowed to say that. Uh, I got into trouble last time for saying that, didn't I? <laughs> Benny from YouTube were on phone, wanted within five oh, minutes. Oh dear, Colin, you can't. <laughs> Colin, you can't say that. Oh, oh dear. Uh, now it's quiet, says uh, Trish Gush. Well, turn your microphone up then. Your volume. Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. We do that on purpose, don't we? We've actually got two microphones. Look, we've got this one here where I'll just tap it lightly so you know I'm so you know it's there. Uh, and I've got this one here, which is what? What we got that one out for? This is you've heard of Magic Mike. Well, this is my Magic Mike. Why? Uh, and and what you can do with it is you can, if I put I can put this to certain places, and and you'll hear things. <laughs> Don't you go looking because you'll spoil it. So if I put it to my head, you'll hear what's going on in my head. Are you ready? There you go. Oh, I'm still going. <laughs> oh, Shall we see what goes on in dear. Sean's head? Are you ready? Do the shake and back and put the freshness back. Do the shake and back and put the Oh, shake and vac advert. That's weird, isn't it? Oh, my God. Shall we listen what's going on in your head? Hang on, let's have a look there. It's a bit weird, that, isn't it? A bit worried about you. Oh. There you go. So that's 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 magic, Mike, is that? There you go. Uh uh, she look, we know you love us. We can tell by that look on your face, because that's like that's the look you have when you really love somebody, isn't it? When like that that heat of the moment. Andy B's being rude. Yeah. Uh, no, I. That, that, that's uh, didn't that used to be in Yugoslavia? <laughs> <laughs> Did it? I think it's one of former Yugoslavia countries, isn't it? <laughs> That's, that's, that's right. Oh, uh, and Andrea says, you read my mind. <laughs> well, at least it's your mind you're reading and not your lips, because oh, that other lady dear. that other lady said we were reading her lips, didn't she? Oh. There we go. Oh, dear. Uh, Lee Brutti says, sounds great. Oh, I fancy a cup of tea rather than this water. He, wants, he mm. wanted water. Now he wants Disarono, and now he wants tea. I actually fancy a cup of tea. Uh, moves like jag Jaguar. That nearly caught me out then. Thanks for the honey. It's delicious and our cupboard smells lovely. Have you sold out yet? We have actually sold out. In we sold out in three quarters of an hour. We've been getting loads of photos from you from, from when your honey's been arriving. Uh, this one from Joe. Uh, that's very nice kitchen worktop and tiles, isn't it? It reminds me of, the, of a Weatherspoon's toilet. <laughs> doesn't it? It's like... <laughs> She just me off now. <laughs> you know what I mean, don't you? It does. It does, doesn't it? Uh, 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 Catoy sent us this one. I don't think she likes people looking at her hands. She's got them covered up. Yeah, she's got them covered up. Uh, Rebecca sent us this one, and it's got a bee look. It's got a bee. You see it look. Yeah, that's awesome. That is awesome. That uh, we also got one from uh, a man with a very, very, very posh name, Roger Howard Smith. He, did, he couldn't even be asked to take his out of the box. <laughs> he was so excited. <laughs> so better take a photo of it. Before I even touch it. Uh, Rob Bradley sent us this one. Have you noticed why? Have you noticed it's really close because his kitchen's a shithole? Yeah, probably. And it's yeah, like, yeah. I'm not, I, don't want, I don't want people to see the kitchen, so I'll go really close up. 
Uh, and finally, he's not with us tonight, but that's Alfie Barlow's hand. Yeah, he's gone out. I've just seen it on Twitter. I don't he's, know where he's, he's gone. He's, he's, he's he all suited up. and booted. He, he is. He's all suited up. And if you remember, uh, do you remember the auction and somebody bought him the jumper? I do. He actually sent us a photo of him in the jumper. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, mate. <laughs> Medis Day did that. <laughs> I'm not going to say Medis whole week because he's a bit young for that. Yeah. <laughs> There you go. Uh, so, uh, but yes, we have sold out of honey now. We actually kept a couple of jars aside in case any got lost in the post, and a couple got lost in the post. So we, we've we completely have. Yes. We've got one left, which is for uh, somebody who adopted the hive. I think Steve Grubb. Steve Grubb. Steve and Caroline. Yeah. Which, if you know, if you're watching, it's on its way out probably Monday. Yes. Yeah. I'm gonna. You'll probably get an. E I'll get. I'll pack it up tomorrow. You'll get an email with your tracking on it and all that sort of stuff. Yes, you will. Uh, oh, super chat! First super chat. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Mwah. There you go. A little kiss for you. Uh, super chats, by the way, it's just a way of supporting the channel. So if you want a guaranteed shout out on the screen, like this lady with a big O face there, why can I never get my fingers right? I can never. Can I? I'm usually quite good with my fingers, but I just when it comes to the screen, I always seem to get it. I was going to say ass about face. You were. You wouldn't want. <laughs> The finger in one and then in the other, would you? You'd want it in your face first, wouldn't you, if it's going to go anywhere. Uh, Don't take long to dive into... Uh, Diggity Dang, what a name. Diggity Dang. That is cool, that, isn't it? What a name. Uh, your mate's brother, look. Ah, chap brazier. Mm. Go on, you can read what? these. Evening, chaps. Hope you're both well. Feeling better now, Sean. Well, yes, it's slowly, slowly. Yeah, it's like put, put your phone on silent. My phone's dinging. Never ever remember. I, I bet it's my sister. Yes. <laughs> uh, Chris, <coughs> excuse me, Chris and Mary. Stop Ma it. Turn it off. I'm trying. Chris and Mary Downs, evening. Uh, looking forward to a great evening's entertainment. They must be watching Holly the Cathy Boat. Mm. She says it's buzzing. Uh, it's all right. Okay. Oh, dear me. Right. Just bear with me a second. I'm going to try something different, so I'll be back in a minute. What you done? I don't know. <laughs> that sounds really different though, doesn't it? Is that working or what? Well, that's from, that's from your Mac. No, you're from my Mac. I don't know, is that working? It, it must sound a little bit different. Mm. Does it sound okay? I think, I think that sounds a little bit loud, to be honest. I don't think it sounds as good because it's a different microphone. But let's, let's see what the people say anyway. That worked. Mm. On now. Uh, I see all the experts are on. Uh, so there's there's a ground loop issue on your microphone. Absolutely not ground. No, it's not. It's not a 50 hertz buzz. It's a faulty cable. That's it. All right. These are the same people that said you needed a full knee replacement. I, <laughs> I saw Steve Grubb there. Hello, Steve. Did Hello, you, Steve. Did you hear us? With your, your honey is on. You've literally got our jar. There was... There was one jar left, which we were keeping, so it's on its way to you, yes. or it, it will be on Monday anyway. Uh, right, where are we? Let's try and find some of these. Uh, yeah, the sound isn't as good, but uh, I don't know. I could play some music and come back, couldn't I? Do you think we should do that and try and fix it? Or you could, you could do some juggling. You could do your juggling, couldn't you? You can't even juggle with one ball. You could do. You take the thing and you start doing some of these and I'm going to start having a go. How can I this. do some of them? Because you can scroll up and down. I'm not turning the microphone off. I'm uh, just... Okay, okay, okay. Yeah? I get that. You are, you are so kind, I'll treasure it. Don't treasure it, eat it, Steve. Please eat it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Seeing if it's out inside it. Oh dear. Don't you making me jump? I'm trying to do this. Sorry. Hey? Queen Cats says hi from Canada. Hello. <laughs> oh my god, you're so loud. That's my sister. Are we still loud? Yeah, it's because you it's because that volume's too high. Oh is it? Uh, okay, right. It's, well, turn your hearing aids off. 
Eh? Oh my love. Reese Holmes says, loves my chicken shirt. You can buy these. I thought I thought you said Go to our website, go to the shop. I thought you were gonna say chicken shit then. Chicken. Yeah, can't say that. Not on this programme. Which chicken on your shirt is our mags, Andrea says. Well, we redesigned them, didn't we? Because Mags originally had a lollipop. I'm going to shut him up for a second. So, which one do you want? I think we're all right now. There we go, we've got the normal microphone back. So, what That's I That's Mags. Mm. Which one's that? And he's one. got to, he's got to mess with me. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, Steve Crombie, I'm listening in Salem, Oregon. Isn't that where all them people died? It's that Salem's lot. All right. Yeah. That were real, wasn't it? Uh, I don't know. Uh, Super Chat from movie. Marcy Desma Des Des Desmarais? Yeah. Desmarais? Desmarais? Desmarais. That sounds posh, doesn't it? It does sound posh. It is. Should, look at that white that white top. That, is, that fits well, doesn't it? I wish, <laughs> I, what? What? I wish I, I wish, no, I wish I could get clothes that fitted like that. Put your brain in gear before your mouth. What? I, I don't know what I've said now. Oh. Uh, Paul Johnson says, give it a blow, Colin. Again. I think that's what I did. Uh, swearing from Michelle Sharp, I think we'll have to ban Michelle Sharp. Won't we? <laughs> shall we, shall we remove her? Shall we ban her? There she's gone. She doesn't know she's paying for my train ticket yet. All oh, right. Okay. Uh, is it right? I'm scared to say your name. I don't know whether it's Nico or Nico or, or I'd what. I'd say Nico. Nico. So Nico gi Coleman. Give us like a, a a a what's it called? Phonetic. Phonetic spelling of it, and then I'll then I'll know. Uh, Neil Murphy says live from the Harecastle Tunnel. What you're from the Harecastle Tunnel, or we are? No, I'm they they will be. I'm watching our volume now to see if it starts buzzing. I again. would imagine. I imagine they're not inside the tunnel. All oh, right. Okay. Uh, in the name of beer, says me and the better half. I think he means love what we do. Keep up the antics. Up the antics. Antics. Yeah, up the antics. Thank, Thank you. Thank you for that. That'll buy you some beer, won't it? You're going through that fast, aren't you, I tonight? I do. I know. I'm, I, need a, I need another drink in a minute. We ain't got none. You haven't drunk this much since his anniversary. <laughs> Why is that funny? Just before it was his thirtieth anniversary, wasn't it in June? In June, yeah. And and apart from drinking a lot, when we were kind of, we were like thinking, what can we do, won't we, for his anniversary? And Sean Come says, Sean says, shall we try Greece? And I says, no, we'll stick with KY. <laughs> 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 Don't like change. <laughs> that just reminded me. Uh, don't get on that subject again. What Greece? Greece is the word. Right, Nico. There you go. Nico. Is it Nico? That's what I said, Nico. Right, okay. Is it a silent K? Yeah. Do Can Nico. <laughs> do Uber deliver to your house for beer? No. We, uh, we've got no Uber up here. We've got no We've oo. got nothing up we've here. No Uber, have we? We've got a fish and chip shop. We've got, yeah, we've just, it's just opened, hasn't it? Yeah. We're going to try it this week. Trex. Tre <laughs> That's glad. It is, isn't it? Yes. I do like rubbing myself with treks. <laughs> uh, James, hello, James. It'll get well, gift Sean. Hope your knees get better soon. Thank you, James. There you yes, go. Yes, they are getting better slowly. Five dollars towards your knee surgery that everybody yeah. tells you you need. It. I don't need surgery. Well, he does, but not on his knees. Uh, Cliff McGee. I wonder if he's any relation to tits. <laughs> <laughs> You know what I'm on about, don't you? I know what you're on about, yeah. From Anchorman. Anchorman the movie. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. I bet you get that all the time, don't you? <laughs> I would piss myself if he said if he were married to her. That would be brilliant. That would be fantastic. Oh, what a super chat. Thank you so much, Cliff. Cheers, Cliff. Thank you. Keep Say it hello up. to Tits McGee for us. We will do. <laughs> Uh, and Rhonda Davis, thank you to you as well. Super chat for all the animals. For all the animals, they they will go. 
far with those. That, that will help because that that pays half of my uh, monthly bill for Sherlock's food, uh, which we've we've just put in today. Yes. Uh, so is is yeah. Right. He actually started eating his food today before Colin finished putting it about. <laughs> when uh, yeah, when 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 we first moved him, he oh. uh, he was a bit obviously he was a bit nervous, wasn't he? Yeah. And uh, if he. It, I mean, he went out straight away, but when I went out, he would make sure he was in the opposite part of the mews that I was in. So if I walked towards him, he would fly to the other side. And then after a couple of weeks, he stopped flying to the other side, didn't he? But just kind of huffed and puffed and clicked his beak at me. Uh, and then today, and then like last week when I started, because I put the food in different places for him. So he has to kind of hunt for it. Uh, enrichment, I think they call it. It they? is, yes. And he kind of started looking and noticing that I had his food, and he's kind of looking instead of looking at me all the time, he's looking at what I've brought him. And today, for the first time, uh, he flew from the opposite end of the mews to where I was, and literally took his food not out of my hand, but I literally I put it on the branch, and he just flew over and took it, and down it went. It's brilliant. Sorry, you're all probably bored with that. <laughs> <laughs> I could talk about owls all day. Uh, Kitty Cat Chat. Yay, thank you. I hope you're having a good evening. Thank you. Thank you so much. We haven't brought us fireworks, have we? We did advertise that I was going to tell people where I'd shoved the fireworks. I think that's what the tweet says. Find out where Colin shoved his fireworks. We are going to play a little game later. Oh, are we? It's based on a competition. That's, this is news to me. It's based on a competition we used to do when I used to work in commercial radio when I was a kid. Uh, and there was a presenter I used to work with called Ray Stroud. Uh, and he used to play a game called What Have I Got in My Hand? And people would ask questions and you basically say yes or no. And people had to guess what he had in his hand. It was all very above board and legit. There was no kind of, do you know what I mean? Nothing untowards about it. Uh, but there you go. So we might play that. But I can't, I can't call it What Have I Got in My Hand? Because obviously that's Ray's. So I'm going to have to do it another way, aren't I? So I'm going to have to put something somewhere and you're going to have to guess where it is. Okay. Uh, is that Hedogene or Hedogene? Heda. Mm. Uh, my mum and I love watching you two. Thanks for all the great videos. Really impressed with the building of Sherlock's enclosure. Thank you. This man, this man should take all the glory holes for that, shouldn't you? Well, you built one into Sherlock's music, I noticed. <laughs> I noticed it about three or four days ago. I've been looking at it thinking, where's the light coming from in this? I thought, he's, he's only gone and cut a bloody glory hole in it. Don't believe a word he says. My sister's just said something on there about this T-shirt. Thank you, Hedda Jean. Hedda Thank Jean, you. Hedda Jean. Uh, well, Andrea Ainge has is, is, is been d disgusting. She's been disgusting again, woman. Uh, Darren loves your cock T-shirt. What's not to love? It's a good T-shirt, good design. Do you want one for Christmas? Yeah, they're in, they're in stock. Buy him one, Michelle. <laughs> I think I, I don't know that they, they are somewhere on 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 the, the the live chat somewhere. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Mike Brown says hi, guys. Uh, great to see you're back. Thank you. You back? You're back. Yeah. Uh, Goldie says, how's the weather been? Has Kieran affected you, or as excuse me, all the weather people call it Kieran. 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 Bizarre. I think it's because it has like a, that that line above the A, doesn't it? Yeah, is it called an Oof. umlaut? That's German. Yeah, but that's what that sign is, isn't it? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I, 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 I don't know. It, we got rain and some wind, but we, it weren't as bad as what it was down south. Mm. No, it won't, were it? No. Uh, speaking of Sherlock, Dave T says, what do you feed Sherlock? Uh, I, I'm going to tell you a little story. If you want to sit yourself down... Because I, I kind of want to explain. A lot of you will have already seen me sort of ranting on about this. Uh, when we did the Q and A vlog on Sherlock, was it last week or the week before? I don't. I don't know. Time just goes. Yeah. And and I was and a lot of people asked what Sherlock eats, and I didn't say in the vlog. And do you know why I didn't say in the vlog? Because you get. <laughs> let's put it the true. Let's let's put it across the nice way. Okay. <laughs> Because the balance of our viewers is quite fine when it comes to things like this. And we know from experience and talking about Sherlock that a large percentage of our viewers were quite unhappy about feeding a captive bird live food or frozen live food. And so it was trying to work out which was going to be more controversial and attract more criticism. 
saying what we were feeding and showing it or just not mentioning it and then telling people who asked, which proved the right thing in, in a way. Uh, but I'll tell you now because I don't give a shit anymore. Uh, so it, it basically he eats freshly frozen uh, day-old chicks. Uh, he eats large mice, small rats, uh, quail, little uh, duck chicks uh, and uh, like beef hearts and things like that. So just stuff that he would get out if he was out and about. Scavenging, yeah. Uh, but we, we feed it freshly frozen uh, and we give him some kind of vitamins and calcium and bits and pieces, supplements that go with it. Uh, and he hunts from the muse as well. You can see, I, I stand and watch him for hours and he doesn't keep his eye on me anymore. He's kind of interested in everything that's going on and you can see when he sees because he's like in the forest, he can see the mice and the voles and he can see things moving about and his attention is like, Phew, like that, like you with oven chips. <laughs> <laughs> oven chips? It's like he can be sat in front room, can't you, watching Escape to the Country? <laughs> and his ear will kind of move a little bit when he hears the freezer door open and he knows the sound of the oven chips being opened. He does that. Doesn't he? And he, start, he starts, yeah. But there you go, that's what we feed Sherlock. I keep having to look at the sound to make sure it's not going again. Uh, okay, uh, people uh, co complaining about adverts. Uh, we've turned the adverts down, but YouTube won't let, let us turn them off. We either have our channel monetized or we don't. Uh, so it's a case of earning less or earning nothing. And obviously we, we do this because we have to earn a little bit from it. So... Uh, there shouldn't be adverts any more than every half an hour. So, uh, well, it's 25 past seven, so that's about right. Uh, so, yeah, you're not missing much, to be honest. Just skip them if you want. Uh, you're not missing much. It's just <clears throat> crap, innit? Uh, Andrea's bought a shirt. Shirt? But if you bought one of these? Lovely. I hope you're wearing it next time I see you. I'm coming in December, so I want me parking. I text you date. We ain't had any parking, have we? No, we haven't on this year. I might have to make some of my own before Andrea makes it for us. Mm. But I'll see you in December. Uh, Lazza says owl pellets are very good fertilizer. I'm, I'm actually collecting them up. They're going with the chicken poop. Are they? Yeah. Uh, Texas is not receiving adverts. It's because you're tight. That's why. <laughs> we know what you like. Those Texans. Yeah, conservative Texans. We know what, we know what you like. Uh, Nikki B says, have you got fireworks your way? It's raining and they are in full swing. I can hear them through the fan extraction in the bathroom. Uh, no, we, we live in the middle of nowhere, so we, we don't... We don't hear them. We don't hear anything. <coughs> we hear sheep. Sheep, don't we? cows. And cows. And the deer. And we hear Sherlock sometimes. Yeah, now. we do. We started hooting, haven't we? Yeah. Do you, want to, do you want to hear a little clip of what Sherlock sounds like? Are you ready? Now, it's actually really, really quiet because I had to record it using my magic mic. Yeah, so you know what's coming. So if you, I actually recorded him. Let me just remove that. So turn your volume right up and then you'll be able to hear it. Are you ready? Uh... There you go. Is that the right button? I don't think it was. It might be this one. There you go. Give up. My sister's on again, look. Have you seen? She's got a cheek to ask that. No. <laughs> uh, Nico says, Philip, I know you're watching. Buy me a new hoodie. <clears throat> some good hoodies on there, actually. I, there is some I nice hoodies one. on there. I actually, I actually fancy one. There you go. Uh, Andrea says, it won't be as moist as hers. It probably won't. You make lovely parking, Andrea. Mm. Yeah. There, there is an advert, in there, in America? About Fanny's cupcakes, <laughs> and about no, there's sort of nothing. You won't find them any more moist than Fanny. <laughs> Have you seen it? It's an actual thing. You've not seen it, right? Google moist Fanny's. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, just, I'm gonna find it on my phone and prove it. Oh my god! The thing is, that word means something different in America. Well, than it does in the UK. That's what she's talking about, isn't it? <laughs> Oh! Right, I'm just Googling moist fannies and just... Uh, I am... I, right, there you go, look. Our muffins are moist and sticky, just like fannies. There you go, look. It's an actual advert. There you go, fannies muffins, look. Told you. 
you always laugh and, and court police and stuff like that. Court police. But it's never my fault, is it? It's, I'm always right. Right, I'm going to scan to the bottom in case we buzz in again. Uh, uh, Marcy loves it when Sean loses it and dies from laughter. <laughs> <laughs> I've, run out, I've run out of drink. I actually, if you're going down and getting one, I think I think I think I might have one. Uh, I'll, get, I'll go in a bit. Laurel Lor, Lor, and Ardy. Laurel Alley. Lor, I don't know. I do need to drink. My favourite two guys. Love the banter between you two. It's so funny and crazy at times. Keep it coming. Karaoke Blokey says, I know what's in Sean's hand. Well, it, it what? Bloody hell. It, that's, that must be a record. Because that's the third one you've had, isn't it? The first one? Yeah, all right. First one you've I've had. I've had it 30 minutes. First one you've had on camera. Catherine says, good evening. We're finally home on... Rah! See? Rah! <laughs> I, I got your email, Catherine. <coughs> yes, he's, uh, stand, he's just not been... I've been a bit whoop whoop for the last few days. Yeah, it's not been good this last few days. That's why there were no vlog yesterday. That's so he will we'll answer it. Nearly no live chat tonight. Uh, but yeah, I will answer it. And to Steve and to David. And there's a few. There's a couple I need to get back to. Yeah. That smells like your vape. It's when you breathe on me. No thanks. When you breathe on me, that it smells a bit like that. Fruity. Earth. Uh, Aki. Icky. Icky. Well, icky somebody icky. said. <clears throat> uh, Jennifer Sherwood, hello, thank you for your super chat. Loving your show. Thank you. Thank you, Jennifer. Loving you, Jennifer. Pickle Minx. Cheeky Biscuit. Oh, I fancy a cheeky biscuit. Uh, Barbara Selden, oh, thank you. Hope you're feeling better. He's the, here's the other half of Sherlock's food. Yeah, he can eat until <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> He's stopping another month. <laughs> Uh, and James as well. Oh, always James. Always, always so James. Generous, You're so generous, mate. Uh, thank you for whatever you need. Love the live show. I actually do need some more lube. And Amazon have got three for £22, so I can... Don't! Been together for over 30 years, haven't we? Uh, we have. And there's not much that annoys him anymore now. Nah, nothing annoys me, really. You don't like it when I wipe it on the curtains, do you still? <laughs> Which is, is that why we have wooden blinds now? Because yes. it makes it more difficult for me to wipe it on the curtains. We don't have curtains anymore. But well, we've got some in the living room. But there's one thing after 30 years that still really riles him up, and that's when I use his toothbrush. <laughs> and I don't know why, because he's had worse things than mine in his mouth, haven't you? But if you can think of another way... Toothbrush. If you can think of another way to get dog shit off trainers... Then I'll gladly try it, honestly. <laughs> oh. Right, let's have a look. Where are we? Scan. Oh, God, we've gone right to the top. We've gone right to the top. We've do gone to again. Do your juggling. There you go. Uh, Richard Hutchinson's not had any adverts. That's, you're blacklisted. I've got told. He's on the list, isn't he? Uh... Uh, Lazar says, what's the best Scottish joke you've heard since we've... Like we are going to take the piss out of Scottish people we while we that. live in Scotland. Oh, dear. Jock walks into a bar. No, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. Uh, Nikki B says, my wife has just asked me if my muffin is moist like Fanny's. You see, I've never had Fanny's, so I don't know how moist they are. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? They could be quite sort of dry for all I know. I just I don't know. <laughs> I don't think you get them in England, do you? <laughs> in Scotland. <laughs> Have you ever had fannies? <laughs> hey. Stop it. Oh, uh, might, might might be a good time. Catherine uh, <clears throat> wants to know how are you feeling right now? Uh, right now, oh. embarrassed, bit hot. No, I'm not embarrassed. You're, I never get embarrassed. You're, yeah, I don't know. I think we're getting close. You're a bit. I'm feeling a lot better, thank you. I mean, he's he's healing slowly. Uh, some James is laughing. Some it's tickled James and David as well. Oh dear. Uh, Raheem says, hey lads, great life so far. I'm always enjoying live videos and other videos you make. Oh, look, it's Doctor Who Scar. It's Doctor Who, it's Raheem, yeah. I remember, I remember from last time. Mm -hmm. Hello. Are you getting excited? Because it's like 25th. Two week away, isn't it? Something like that. 25th, three weeks. Three weeks. Wow. Uh, okay. Keith says, is Sean still on crutches? I saw on the last vlog that he was, and uh, I was a bit late for your live chat. Uh, no. 
I'm not still on crutches. Uh, I've got physio booked and an x-ray to be booked and all sorts, but it's getting better slowly. I've got some sweets. You've heard of Lin Lindor, haven't you? Lint, Lindor, the, 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 the ones that look like that. Well, these are off Inverness Market, aren't they? And no. There's, there's, there's no kind of... We don't know what they are. It doesn't even say Lindor. It says uh, Lindy, doesn't it? And there's no flavours to them, so we have to... I can't believe a word he says. We have to guess what flavours they are. I, do you want a taste? No. Mm -hmm. No, because you said not to talk while I've got... All right, oh, yeah. See if you can guess what it is. Nuts. Mmm. Nugget. Pop Nougat. Popcorn. Yeah, I can taste popcorn. I can't taste popcorn. I can taste yeah. I can taste it. Oh, that's rank. <clears throat> you were doing that about half an hour before we came on air, weren't you? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, making me laugh. It makes me want to go for a pee. Uh, Lou at Fernley <laughs> says, flip in late, didn't get a notification. Well, turn them on, you know. Turn them on. Sean does his wibbly wobbly bell, don't you? I do. Uh, David's still laughing at something, I don't know why. Uh, no, we're not going there. <laughs> uh, Heather, Heather B, isn't she from M People? That's Heather Small. Well, B must be like a medium then. <laughs> uh, hello, how are you both, says Heather. Very good. We're okay, thank you. <clears throat> I'm drinking water and I want some Disserano. I'm going to go, shall I go get you some? Okay then. Not only a little one though. Yeah, I will. You know, yeah. I'm like a little whisper. Oh, we've got Aurora Watch. Uh, P uh, thank Cloudy. You, thank you, Heather. Uh, P Met says, I just Googled Moist Fanny and he's gone blind. <laughs> <laughs> don't, blame, don't blame us for that. Uh, Solar Life Portugal says, I bet he hasn't even had fannies, even mildly moist ones. He needs a wee, I can tell, don't, don't you? No, it's my leg. Is it? Your third one? Yes. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Uh, right, let's stop with fannies now. Uh, Juju says, don't spoil a drink in the studio. Yes, we have to be very careful. Where Sean sits over this this side, there's actually not much... I'll show you actually where Sean sits on this side. There's actually not much he can damage. You can see Grogu, uh, but that's where he sits. But where I sit here on this side, that's where all the radio studio stuff is. So that's why I don't drink much on this side. Oh, that's good. Camera stayed in the same place. Yay! Uh, Tom says, Arch just stubbed, stubbed my toe on my footstool. Why did you do that? Uh, Alistair says, Sean, are you excited for Doctor Who's 60th anniversary on the 25th of November? We were just talking about that. He says yes. He says yes. Uh, right, let's go back to these super chats. Uh, Kim Wilson, hello to you. Uh, keep smiling. You are both fantastic. Thank you. So are you. Uh, karaoke blokey, uh, jam shed and Jaffa cakes. Thank you for the joy you bring me and the love of my life. Oh, thank you. Jaffa cakes are ace. Uh, and Ted Barnett, thank you. Thank you for that, Ted. Uh, I think, Ted, you've just uh, taken a share in adopting a beehive, if I if I think. I think I saw that email come through a couple of days ago. Uh, so I've got that to sort out on Monday as well uh, and get your name on a plaque, I think. I think that's the right one. Uh, that is you, isn't it, Ted? That's got to be. There's only one Ted Barnett that follows us. I'm sure there is. Uh, Nikki says, I, I wonder if Fanny had a cat. Did I just spit some? Not then. Yeah. Uh, I wonder if Fanny has a cat. I don't know. Uh, B is my second name. Be oh, it's Heather. Be there you go. You see, it's not a medium. Uh, better swap tiles. Sean can have water. You can drink. <laughs> I, I actually don't drink that much. To be honest, uh, I used to do, but I don't anymore. It's not like I have a problem or anything. I just don't drink anymore. Uh, just beautiful. I don't know what you're talking about. Me, Sean, the room, the office, Grogu. Grogu's beautiful, isn't it? Uh, Scott Chase, uh, what happened to the space launch in Scotland? It's still going ahead. 
uh, they're, they're actually building it now. And I keep meaning to get across to see it, but it's very difficult to get access to the site because the site, if you remember from the vlog we did on it, is set quite a way back from the road. Uh, and we're not allowed to take the drone up in that area anymore because of the building works and stuff. Uh, so I'm trying to get access and I think it might actually be better uh, to wait until it's finished. And I'm actually, I'm getting some footage from the people uh, who own it from Spaceport Sutherland and I'm gonna get some footage from them on the build. So it's kind of coming, uh, but I'll tell you more about that when I know more about it. There, there is, the follow-up story is coming, but I'm just waiting to uh, to get it done. I don't want to say too much, and I always do, don't I? Uh, Dallas says, good day, guys. I'm late. I was celebrating my birthday today. Yes, my name is Genuine. I thought it was Dallas. Now I'm confused. Uh, Ellen is supposed to be working, but she loves us too, which is all right. Uh, Juju says, how are the doggies? They're absolutely fine. Uh, Nico says, I want to sponsor a hive. Okay, uh, all you need to do is go there. If you go there or click the link in the video description that says adopt a hive, and you can either take a share where you share a plaque with a couple of other people, or you can adopt one all to yourself for either a year or a lifetime. Uh, so if you want to adopt a sponsor a hive, adopt a hive, uh, just either scan that QR code uh, or there's a link in the video description. Uh, cheers, me dear. You can talk for a bit because I'm absolutely shafted. I can talk for a bit. I'm shafted. <clears throat> he's shafted. Raheem says he's so excited. Oh, hang on, I'm on wrong one here. He's so excited for the 60th anniversary of Doctor Who, 25th of November. Yes, I am as well. I like Doctor Who. I'm a bit of a geek about it. Yeah. What... Are you two favourite go-to drinks? Oh, that's nice. Um, Has that got some in it? That tastes different. Mm -hmm. Mine is Guinness. I like, I like, if I go out, I like to drink Guinness. Unless we're eating and then it'll be just lager because Guinness can be quite heavy with food. But yeah. Volvos are supposed to be heavy, aren't they? <laughs> A lot of people say Volvo. that. No, a lot of people say that Volvo is supposed to be as mostly people that have been run over by one. Thank you, Reese. Does anybody ever call you Reese's Pieces? I wonder. Uh, Ted says keeping bees is tops. There you go. It really. Is. Lara Jameson says, "How far are you from Inverness? Uh, on the map, about yeah, that far north." Mm. <laughs> We're quite far north. Uh, we're about an hour and a half away, aren't we? Yes, about an hour and a half further north. further north from Inverness. It's actually quicker for us to go out into the sea than it is to go to Inverness, isn't it? We're closer to John O'Groats. I thought you were going to say Sweden then. <laughs> love that chicken. People are loving the chicken shirt. So uh, Sam loves the chicken shirt, and Zvana loves the chicken Z shirt. Zvana. 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 Uh, good morning from Australia. Australia. I have to read that because I have, I sometimes get Austria and Australia mixed up. Why? They're spelt different and they're a different part of the world. Yeah. Volvo 245, is that the one that hit you? Is it? <laughs> Here we go. Decent question. Jenny Willow. Sean, who is your favourite Doctor Who? Uh, uh, the Doctor Who I... Who was my doctor when I was a child was John Pertwee, but I did like Matt Smith. <clears throat> nobody asked me, so I'm not going to answer that. We know what yours is. Yours is no. Um... Nobody wanted to know. Don't tell them. Uh, Phil Brr says, "How are you? How are you two doing? We're doing good. We're doing good. And what's your favourite Doctor Who baddie? Oh, it's got to be the Daleks. Always." Again, nobody asked me, and I've got really interesting answers, but nobody gives a <laughs> shit, so you'll never find out, will Look you? Look what Abby Shell says about how far north we live. It is a bloody long way. But well <laughs> yeah, but you don't drive. Darren drives. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, Craig Holmes says, uh, super chat from you. Thank you. Can we say hello to uh, Craig's mum, Doreen? She's just out of hospital after an op. Hello, Doreen. And Get better soon. Both. 
Oh, she loves us both. Get better soon, Doreen. Get better soon. Whatever it is that's happened, I hope it heals quickly. Send me a photo of your scar. <laughs> what, is that weird? <laughs> yes. Is it? I'll... <laughs> Get better soon, Doreen. I think the best Doctor Who baddie is the statues. Ah, right. See what I mean about my answer being better? Yeah, they are good. And my favourite Doctor's <coughs> David. What are they called? I can't remember. David Tennant. Is it the Weeping Angels? Weeping Angels, yeah. Thank you, Beth, who is my favourite Doctor Who. <laughs> Thank you. I think David Tennant. Yeah, you like David Tennant, don't you? Like He's coming David. back in Nova in I like 25th. David Tennant. I liked the bit where he says, I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I don't want to go, because that's me. He's going to say that again, I bet. Uh, Raheem, John Pertwee is his favourite Who, Doctor Who, and Tom Baker was your favourite Doctor, Colin. Uh, David Tennant. <laughs> well, Tom Baker was your Doctor when you were a kid. Tom Baker was my Doctor when I was a kid. And I liked, I liked it, it. I really liked that one where uh, he was the curator as well. Oh, in the 50th anniversary. Yeah. Is that the one where they brought Van Gogh back? Yeah. No, that's that one before that. That nearly made me cry, that one. I liked that one. Oh, Simon Biggs, what creature would you play in Doctor Who? You'd, you'd just play the madhead, wouldn't you? Yeah, you'd play Amy Pond. <laughs> <laughs> Amy Pond. You'd be good at Amy Pond. <laughs> Wrong colour hair. It don't matter, they've got wigs. I'm sure she wore a wig. <laughs> Yeah. No, that's the road air. Her I own, could play own K ginger air. I'd play K9 because I just like that position. <laughs> All four. <Yeah. laughs> oh. oh. Good question. I'm liking these questions now. Oh. Uh, the master. The master. Oh, he's good. Mm. The fav my favourite master was. Um, oh, what's his name? Not John Sim. John Sim. You thought John I Sim? I thought John Sim was a good master. I thought the last one. I've forgotten his name. Oh, oh. Darker guy. Yeah, the, the Asian guy. Really good actor. Brilliant. Really good yeah, actor. Brilliant. Really kind of like psycho. Yeah, he's brilliant. Absolutely. I can't brilliant. remember his name. Uh, bow ties are cool, says Nikki. Our cat Spike has a bow tie like Matt Smith. <laughs> Weeping Angels, that's right, Kitty Cat. Yeah. Don't blink. Don't blink, that's yeah. That's the one. Uh, Marina hated the Cybermen. I thought the Cybermen are a bit boring. I can uh, imagine being scared of them when you were a kid, though. Yeah. My I, sister. I remember watching Doctor Who when we were little and it had giant maggots yes, in it. Yes, it did. Did it? Yes. Giant maggots. Um, is that, I don't know, it's Melita or Melita. They frightened me like the Daleks. Uh, Sophia Pond was hit by a BMW. Who oh, was just saying about you being like Amy Pond as well? That's a coincidence. <laughs> you were hit by a BMW. I bet oh. they're heavy. Uh, Reese Holmes, what was your favourite Doctor Who episodes? Mine's the one with where they take Vincent van Gogh. Where they take him to see his paintings. Yeah. 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 Uh, mine, I liked. I I liked the fiftieth uh, anniversary. I like it when they bring more Doctors in. And when they bring them together. Sue Todd, I loved Catherine Tate in it. <clears throat> yeah, she's, she's good. She's coming back in. She. Yeah, she's back as well. Uh, Simon says the one with the three bobbies. I don't know what that is. Do you? Three bobbies. Mm. Caram, I don't know what they mean. I don't know. Uh, oh, Nikki's back. Super chat. Thank you. Can we please do a special mention to Nikki and my wife as it's our fifth wedding anniversary on the 10th of November? Yay! Happy anniversary. Shall we do the anniversary dance? Yes. Ready? Three, two. No, that's not right. <laughs> Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary for the 10th. Happy anniversary. Oh, God, look what's happened now. It's gone all. You, keep, you, always, keep, you always do that. No, I don't do up, that. It down, do, up. And then it, he'll say, read it, and it's going up, it down, that. up, down. Will you shut the... <laughs> Missy. Missy. Missy yeah, was, was good. good. Not my favourite, but she was good. She was good. Shauna's Amy Pond. There you go, you see. Yeah, there you go. You've been cast. Sharon Bamberlook. Uh The Van Gogh episode is one of my favourites. And, and Blink. Blink, yeah. yeah. Uh, hi, guys. Why is the door tiled? Uh, it's uh, it's just an acoustic treatment. It's like a, a a felt kind of cloth thing. It's like these. The, the, these are acoustic as well. They're, yeah, uh, the panels with the lights around them. Uh, Spongy. This is where I do. Uh, well, the radio studio is here, just to, to this side. You can just see it in the corner of the screen. Uh, so, and I do a lot of voice recording and radio, and I do all the voiceovers for the vlogs and, and other things. 
in here. So it stops the echo. It means that I can uh, get good quality voiceovers. That's I've what it is. I've just noticed, have we got product placement in here? Yes, we have. <laughs> Fox is a float book. <laughs> <laughs> there was a dildo on there, and I just thought it won't it won't look right, and just Pete, you'll see it. And and did I say dildo? You did say it, yes. I did. I don't mean dildo. I meant I can't remember what I meant. Something to do with David Essex. Uh, I don't know. Juju's lost it. There you go. We should employ a Cyberman as a moderator. You'd get zapped. Ninety percent of you'd get zapped. <laughs> no, no, you wouldn't. The 0.1% would get zapped. Andrea likes Missy as well. Yes. Uh, Judith used to hide behind the settee when she came on. Uh, Roger Delgado was a great master. I think that's before my time, is yes, it? Yes, that's early. Is it? Delgado, another yeah. one, look there. Uh, will there be a reaction video to the new Doctor Who? No. We don't well, do that sort of stuff. We don't. The, who's that lad that wants to come and see us? Oh, he's a young lad, isn't he? American. It's uh, Jay Summer. I can't remember where it is. It's a young American lad. Uh, he's, and, just, he's recently visited the UK. And he really wanted to come and see us, and we missed the message. Yeah. So uh, next time he's in the UK, you'll probably see him. And he here. really wanted... And he, I think he was in Inverness, one here, he? Was, Loch Ness. Uh, it was in the Highlands. And he re he wanted to come see us and he sent us a message. And I I literally missed the message. I, when I saw the message and I messaged him straight away and he was it was literally on the train down towards Glasgow and then I think York. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, he does a lot of reaction videos. Yeah, I think he, he did a reaction video of one of our boating videos. He did, he? yes, yes. I think, yeah. Uh Lindy says, I'm back. My daughter pooped, popped, popped. over. I'm glad she popped and didn't poop. James remembers William Hartnell. Bloody hell, how old are you then, James? Well, he, he started in 1963. The year before you were born. The year before I was born. He did 1963, and I think he did about seven years. Mm. So, yeah. So that's that's the year that your mum and dad, isn't it? For you, you were <laughs> conceived. I was conceived on that year, yes. I bet it were in a co-op. In fact, it was first broadcast... And it was broadcast the day Kennedy was shot. So that might be six. That's sixty-three, yeah. The day Kennedy it? was shot. Of course, then nobody watched it. Uh, Liz Holmes says Doctor Who's banned in their house. They can't watch it. Drives her crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Sasha Dowan. That's Sasha it. Sasha Dowan. That's yeah, it. Yeah, the master Anthony Ainley was yeah, a hoot too. Brilliant. Yeah, Sasha. He yeah, is Sasha really Dowan's good. good. Yeah. Uh, what do you think of the Doctor Who movies? Uh... Whoa. Peter Cushing, no. 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 Favourite episode, Caves of Andros... Andros... Yeah, the Caves one. <laughs> Evening, Philip! Hello, Philip! Cheers! Uh, Alistair says, my favourite Doctor Who episode is New Earth. Yeah. Uh, Doctor Who buddy was Sasha... Yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, Blooming adverts. Well, yeah, two an hour, one every half an hour, so we're about right, we're about right. Uh, episode, yep, yeah, hello. Uh... Ebr is that Ebron or Ebron? What That's a name. Ebron. Jurgensen. What a uh, name. Ebron, yeah. I love names like that. Hello, Jurgensen. gents from Toronto getting late here. Are we been drinking? We might we might be a little We bit might be. Whiskey and Disarono. We might a little, Amaretto. a little bit of mead been drinking. Yay. Who would you pick to play Davros? What? Solar Life Portugal says. Who would I pick to play him? Well, it doesn't matter who plays him. So long as because it's all makeup, so long mm. as they get the voice right, and that is yeah, that's it. So it don't matter. Simon says it's a padded room, so nobody can hear the screams. <laughs> little bit of that, little bit of the acoustics. <laughs> uh, love Doctor Who with Billy Piper. I yeah, I think uh, yeah, she was good. David Tennant and and Billy she played Rose, didn't she? She played Rose. I think they were the best ones. I liked them. Uh, losing Rose through the rift. Yeah, I remember that one. That was quite sad. If you had a TARDIS, where would you go? Um, <clears throat> I would like to... I'd like to visit the 30s. It says a TARDIS, not a time machine. TARDIS is a time machine. Even yeah, it goes to different worlds, yeah, but doesn't it? That, that would be as simple as that. I'd like to visit the 1930s. I'd go to the world the where... The I'd go to the world where it's just Justin Bieber's without any clothes on. Everywhere. <sighs> all singing his songs. Not all the time. They'd stop to go to sleep and stuff like that. That'd be good. That'd be good, wouldn't it? Robin. 
It's JPS. The that, guy who does the reaction yeah. videos, it is. Yeah, that's the one. So he'll be he'll be he'll be coming back because he said he's coming yeah, back. Yeah, he's gonna to come him. back to the UK and he's gonna come up and visit us. God, can you imagine a video with us and him? Well he usually comes with a friend, a mate as well, doesn't he? A We're friend. Blow his mind because he's like just so excited about everything. Yeah, he isn't is, he? yeah, he's good. Uh hi Chris T. Hello, Chris. Hello, Chris. Hello. Uh RB says I remember the first episode, it was shown twice. It was. First time because Kennedy was shot, so nobody watched it. Uh, Goldie was three when it started. Well, we know how old he is then, don't we? Yeah, we know how you, you are now. 82. Uh, Nikki B says, we need an Ood. Oh, Ood's a race. Ood's a race. I love the episode where he's pegging out the world. Now, I wondered where it was going, where she said he was pegging. <laughs> I only learned recently what that means. Oh, we've got a lot We've got a lot of Doctor Who fans on here. Mm. He says changing the subject. I like the Ood. Okay, I wish he could buy them lights from Ikea. You know the lights? Oh, the, the lights that the Ood yeah. Oh. Yeah, and uh, the... hold. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Laurie Grant says hi to my friend. You're very quiet. You're no good in radio or TV, you, because you're just like quiet. What have I done? You just go quiet. It's like when it's I go. Because I will read, I can't talk and read at the same time. When I go quiet, you should be ready with something. Or a funny face. The, bl okay. the blind will really appreciate that. The sister says, we were conceived on the same date, but two years apart, it was the second trial. <laughs> That's true. I We've was... got the same birthday, two years difference. What, you mean they weren't happy with you, so they had another go? Yeah. <laughs> That's what she's saying. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Laurie Grant says, that's my favourite couple from West Coast of Canada. Hello. Oh. Uh, Lee Brutey, William Hartnell, three-year day after JFK was shot. Yeah. Uh, Kerry Miller says, my favourite was camera number nine's appearance. I don't get that. Camera number nine's appearance. Does she mean K9? Okay, I don't know. You've confused us there. You'll have to, you'll have to explain that one. <laughs> uh, Scott Moore, hi to you. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Scott. You can have a little kiss. Oh. But only there, not there. Uh, see, when I go back to it, it's that that takes me to the, to yes, the, it is to the bottom. It. It's not me. So thank you. Are you going to apologise to me now? Uh, Vinny says, which... It's there. Yeah, but it's gone from here now. Sorry. Our system is shite. <laughs> uh, which character would you both like to play in Doctor Who? I think we've just done this one, haven't we? No, we haven't. Oh, which character would we both like to play? Yeah. Oh, I'd be the master. I know you would, yeah. I'd be a good master, me. Yeah, you Because I'm proper psycho, aren't I? I can just lose it and nobody will know. I don't know who I'd like to play. Amy Pond. Hey. No. Well, you couldn't be an Ood because you can't keep your mouth shut. You, you Ood's don't... talk. Do they? Yeah. yeah but it's you... the silence that don't talk. Ah, right. I'm getting confused, aren't you? Oh, yeah, the Ood, yeah, the Ood talk a bit like David from Cruising the Cut, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Yes. I had a dream the other night that uh, Country House Gent was kicking the shit out of him. <gasps> No, I did. Really? I had a dream that Country House Gent caught up with him and he was kicking the shit out of him on Topa. No, so, yeah, would, I don't know. You wouldn't be a good Ood. I don't know what I'd play. No. Uh, I don't know. They're all quite evil, really, aren't they? Yeah. Well, the Ood's not evil, you but could, the rest of them are you, all quite evil. You couldn't play an evil one. You'd have to play a nice one. What about Sarah Jane? She's dead. <laughs> Is it? No, I know who you could be. You could be Captain Jack. Captain Jack? Yeah. Time traveller. Yeah. It's quite good looking, dyes his hair, likes boys. I don't dye my hair. That's you. Well, you used to do. I used to do. Yeah, got a lot I in did. common. I used to dye my hair. Gents, don't ever dye your hair. Got Let it go grey. I used to dye my hair, and I look back at the photos now, and I just think, Sean, you look a pillock. <laughs> uh, Raheem says, if I was Doctor Who, I would have you two as my companions. I oh, could never get anything done. <laughs> <laughs> You'd never get anything done. That would be good. Though. We'd be good companions, wouldn't we? Uh, Alistair says, I like it when Peter Capaldi was sitting in Davro's chair and he said to the Daleks, so anyone for Dodgems? I don't remember that. Yeah, I do, yes. <laughs> yes, he was sat in, in right in the middle of all the Daleks. Uh, Lara says, uh, you do radio? What sort? Uh, well, I have my own radio station. Have, uh, have you been asleep? <laughs> Wake up! Uh, called uh, Mind Station. In fact, there might be a, 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 a link. Might be a link. There you go. Look. Uh, so that's that's my radio station. Well, it's not my. I, I'm not on it a lot. 
I'm just the cover guy sometimes, but it's my station. But yeah, there's a lot of presenters on there. It's uh, yeah, some and good I, presenters on there. I do stuff for other radio stations and interviews and stuff and podcasts and stuff as well. Yeah, there you go. <clears throat> you talk for a little bit. I'm just going to highlight some that you should do because I'm just going to clear my throat. Okay, Hubby just ordered me the chicken T-shirt. Oh, Joe, lovely. It is a good one. Hugh Doc Who fan? Eh? Do you mean huge? Hey, Scott, he's eating chocolate. Ah, uh, Tom Barber. Tom Barber. Tom I'll Barber's I'll on. Read Tom Barber. He's my mate. He's Tom Barber. Yes. Get rid of the mind station. Thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Never um, seen Doctor Who, Star Trek, Star Wars, etc. Really struggling with fiction, especially <laughs> Tom. I know where you're coming from because he's the same. You know he's the same. And we've never talked about this before, but am I not like that? Yes, you are. Yeah, yeah. Tom is uh, Colin's friend, and they get on really Not well. like that. They get on... He's my friend like that. T Tom's married with kids. Mm. Yeah. But, but people don't know. Yeah, they... When you said he's my friend... He's, he's another one with ASD. Don't be telling him personal information. He, Tom doesn't mind. He works for NASA. He does work for NASA. Top bloke. A really good bloke. But definitely, yeah, sci-fi yeah. stuff just... Colin tolerates Doctor Who, and he does like some episodes. I can ask him blah, blah, blah from... Episodes we've watched, and I don't remember what happened. I think the only reason I like the Van Gogh one is because he's like whoop up, I like me. Yes, he, yes, and he I kind did. of related to yes, it. Yes, he had Asperger's, so as well. I could kind of like empathize. He struggled with yes, all the stuff. He did struggle, yeah. Nice to see you, Tom. Thank yes, you, Tom. Nice to see you. Get on the phone. We need to arrange this cruise. Yes, again, not where it sounds like <laughs> people. The actual cruise. No, Tom, Tom's got a couple of boats, so uh, Colin's going to go have some fun, aren't you? Chrissy, again, not how it sounds. Uh, unless you're up for that. Uh, Chrissy, no, uh, hi, Colin. Remember the camera you were thinking about for Sherlock's area? I was thinking about a 1080p outdoor trail and wildlife camera. A great show, Chris from City. Mm. Yes, uh, still looking at options for cameras. Uh, I have one on one of the apiaries that works with 4G. The problem is, is that Scotland doesn't, the Highlands of Scotland doesn't get a lot of sunlight from now till about next March, uh, enough for the solar to charge the batteries up. Uh, and the thing is, Sherlock doesn't do a lot. He doesn't. He <laughs> Most of the time, he's he just sat there. He literally just stands there he all day. He just stands there. It might actually be better to have like a, like, a, what's it called? Like when Match of the Day do it, like a highlight show. <laughs> well, today he jumped from this perch to this perch. Yeah. Uh, but We're still I'm, thinking about it. I'm and looking at. Things. I'm still working on it. I really am. I'm still working on it. Uh, let's do some more super chats. Uh, so, uh, Freddie Van, hello. Can you say good luck to Baxter, who's off mountaineering with Bear Lodge very shortly? We all love you. Ooh. Oh, I'd, I'd like to try mountaineering, but I'm proper pussy. I'm proper scared about that. Uh, Why? I don't know. I keep getting mountain. No, I keep getting mountaineering and that other one mixed up where you go in ground and it's really tight and you might get trapped. Potholing. Potholing. Yeah, I can't do that. It's completely different. I know, but it, it makes me. Think, I know my hands are sweating just thinking about. No, I wouldn't that. go potholing. Uh, but good, but good luck. Yes, thank you, Freddie. Anyway, mountaineering. At least you got. Well, it depends where Bear Lodge yeah. is, but the weather's all right here. I don't know. What With it, Bear Lodge. It, it might be enough. I don't know. So who's Bear Lodge? I don't know. Don't know. But good luck. Good luck. But good luck. Baxter. <laughs> I think we made a right balls up for that I one. Shall we, we do yeah. that one again? We, are, we always do. Eleanor Gillespie. Oh, what a PhD. name. PhD. What a name, Eleanor Gillespie. P She's special. It's like... And you've got a PhD. No, it's like her name's made out of balls, isn't it? Because it kind of rolls. It's like Eleanor Gillespie. And you've got a PhD. No, it's not a PhD. It's what? just it's just a master's. A master's. Oh. Pull my finger. No, I'm not pulling your finger. <laughs> Uh, anyway, for the bees, for the bees chickens and chickens, and Sherlock. Thank you so much, Eleanor Gillespie. Thank you, Eleanor. PhD. Yeah, <laughs> I've just, I've just got a crappy masters, not a PhD. Ph. It's like masters. Yeah, PhD. Yeah. Clever girl. Oh boy. Oh non-binary. You've got to be so bloody careful these <laughs> days, haven't you? I don't know. <laughs> James is on again. 
Uh, for Otis and Ollie, thank you. Did thank you, you James. Did, I, You're I so generous. I didn't put the photos on of Otis and Ollie. No, you didn't. Uh, that would have been good. That uh, check out our social media. We took I took Otis and Ollie uh, to to the favourite place for a run this morning, and it's literally a lake. All the paths around this place, the 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 sea came right over. They were doing dive bombs in the water. Yeah, it was like Otis was just running through it, and Ollie was literally like jumping five or six feet over it. It's amazing. Right, see if we can fix this without it. No, it just goes straight to the top again. So let's go down to the bottom. Right, we're just going to miss some out because we're going to just try and scroll down to the bottom a little bit. If we miss what you've put on the chat wall, try again. We'll hopefully get to it. Uh, Ted Barnett says, Colin, please tell us about the additions to your photo book. Your photography is fantastic. Thank you. Uh, so there. all we've done, I think, that's, I think that's last year's actually. Is it? Which is why it's on display. Uh, all we've done is we've added probably about half a dozen pages. Yeah. And it it's just there's some pictures of Ollie. There's some more uh, Northern Lights photos. I think there's some more deer photos and Highland Coo photos. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, we've actually released a new version for 2024, which you can get now. Foxesafloat.com forward slash shop. Uh, or just go to foxesafloat.com and click the shop tab. By uh, today, it'll be out on Monday. Yeah, we've the actually post. got them in stock, and we're yeah. we're sending them now. So I think the price has dropped to is it twenty nine pound? Yeah, price has dropped. Uh, price has dropped to twenty nine ninety nine. Five quid, hasn't it? Uh, the postage and packing has dropped because we're sending it now. We're not paying somebody else to do it. Uh, we can get them straight out. We'll write a little personal message in the book for you if you want it for Christmas or something. Uh, and also, there was something else with the books as well. I can't remember. Don't know, but there's these. Uh, oh, yeah, and the calendars are, are still in stock as well. So if you want a calendar... This one's good, uh, what I've got. <laughs> uh, the calendars are in stock and we're sending them. So, again, uh, we can get them out straight away within the next day or two. I've wrapped one up. I've wrapped, I've wrapped one up for my brother-in-law. Uh, who? <laughs> I've only got one brother-in-law. Ooh, Darren won't like that. <laughs> he might get off on August. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, if you are a Patreon supporter or a VIP YouTube member, uh, you also got 20% off the calendars and photo books as well. Uh, so I'm not going to tell you what the code is. You'll have to go onto <laughs> Patreon, uh, of which you're a member, or YouTube members and go into the community and there will be a post from about a week ago uh, with your discount code and you'll get 20%. Uh, or if you want a book, I mean, this is a bit cheeky and I'm giving this away. If you want a book, just become a Patreon member for like one month, get the discount code, buy all the stuff you want and you've got a bit of discount. You might save yourself a few, Bob. And there you go, you see. My cousin's on. Right, I know. I just need to go back up here because we need to uh, just take it from there. Uh, karaoke Bloki, have you still got a time for the PlayStation, Colin? I got the VR and horror games scale living daylights on me. Uh, still got a PlayStation, hardly ever use it. I just, I hadn't had time. No, you haven't, have you? I did get the VR kit ages ago. But you I never mean, used it? I never used it, and it made me feel a bit sick. Yeah. So I didn't use it. Uh, last horror game I played, I think, was Resident Evil 4. That's like 20 years ago, isn't it? <laughs> you like shoot em games. Yeah. Uh, you could do a Sherlock what song. Could do. Uh, Sherlock needs a Watson. Uh, if you watch the vlog we've just done about Sherlock, we explain why he doesn't need a Watson. Uh, James says, Rappling down a cliff used to trip me out when I was in the army. What's rappling? Heights bother me, but had no choice. I don't know what rappling is. Is that like being thrown down in just your underpants? Probably. I'd be totally up for that. Probably. I'm oh look, Steve, Steve's Steve's advertising for us. Uh, fantastic <laughs> photos of Ollie and Otis. They are it. I liked them. I think they're really good. Uh, fireworks going crazy in South London. South London. South London. Uh, the ones that make me laugh are the ones that are set off in broad daylight. The ones yeah, that all you hear is the bangs. You don't you don't see anything. The ones that make me laugh are the ones that are like really crap. Do you know what I mean? At like one ninety nine, <laughs> yeah. and they sort of go. <laughs> We had need to get some. No, we're not. We're not animals. No, yeah, we have. Uh, Sue. Sue, my cousin. We I, went to see Abba together. I once went potholing. Nightmare. It was really? the best of two evils. Either go down the hole or stay on the bus with a pervy teacher. Oof. I think I'd have picked the pervy teacher. It depends, <laughs> though, doesn't it? 
You, you know what I'm like, though, don't you? Get it out there, Mr. Watkins. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. We had a fab time at Abba, me and Sue Bates there. Yeah. Oh, I couldn't do pothole in. I couldn't do pothole in. That's Otis. Uh, cheeky, Nobody there. Cheeky man is looking trim and fur. Trim and fur? Fur? Mm. Yeah, fur it. Like a bear. What's he barking at? <laughs> uh, I think... Uh, oh, him. That one, uh, yeah. Spelunking is the worst. Now, I've heard of that before. That's, Spelunking? Yeah, that's like a... Like, uh, yeah. I've I can, heard of that. I can, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Dave, Dave Arundel says that mine arrived the day before yesterday. Nice what? one. Book. Calendars. Calendars. Yeah. Oh, right. Uh, <clears throat> I like the photos of on Otis and Ollie. I think Ollie would do very well on Crufts. Do you think? Winning the flyball competition. You don't know him. <laughs> uh, RB says, heights don't worry me. I can look up at them any time. It's not the height that kills you, is it? No, it's the fall. It's, it's the hit. hit. <laughs> yeah, it's hit, hitting the ground, that, that does it, yeah. Andy B, uh, hi guys, love you both. My honey is delicious. Can't wait to put up my calendar for 2024. 20, I hope there will be one for 2025. Of course there will. Of course there will. Yep. Uh, you go down a rope. It's called rappelling. All oh, right, I didn't know that. I've never didn't heard that, that before. Never heard that. Thanks, James. We have some ropes, but we use them for totally different things than that, don't we? <laughs> what? We do. Okay. We like... We tie like bales of straw together with it. What are you thinking of? Shut You're up. thinking of that day with them pallets, aren't you? Pallets? Yeah. Oh, no, we're not, we haven't done that yet, have we? Uh, high, high rappelling. Abseiling. High rappelling. High rappelling. Oh, no. High rappelling. Oh, I give up. Uh, fireworks now. Is it Guy Fawkes Day? It's not. It's Guy Fawkes Day tomorrow. There you go. <laughs> uh, Pandajit says you are fit. I'm fit. You are fit. I'm fit. You are. F you wouldn't believe how many of these people would like to. <laughs> were you? I'm an old man. It don't matter. You still got it, as I found out. <laughs> you wrecked it. <laughs> I wrecked it. <laughs> Told me a new one. <laughs> uh, Jane loves the shirt. Chuck T-shirt. Uh, Dave likes it. He was talking about his photo book. Yeah. Uh, Steve Grubb went pothole in years ago due to his portly stature. Yeah, his, I'm a bit portly. His fellow potholers nicknamed me the plug. <laughs> yeah, that'd be me, mate. Yeah, that'd be me. <laughs> oh, I couldn't. My hands are sweating thinking about it. No, I, I, they come up on reels sometimes, you know, when we're watching reels on Instagram. And for some reason, I think I must have watched one for longer than a few seconds. So Instagram then automatically thinks that it's an interest. So it just bombards you with pothole in videos. Do you remember? Do you remember the when we worked in the Maldives? We were diving structures. There were a. It weren't caves dive site but there were a, a site where there were a cave and there were all sorts inside yeah me and barbara went inside there did you because mm. it were only small wasn't it yeah mm. oh i wouldn't have gone in that yeah there were all sorts inside yeah uh we'll come to that in a sec rob rob emerson uh ollie has set our ollie it was actually otis our otis has set off his ollie <laughs> yeah otis is the barker yes uh ollie just Ollie's, soup. Ollie's actually all right. It's only if Otis goes really mental. Yeah. In it. Uh, Wayne and Waynetta. Hello, Hello, boys and girls. They're here. They're queer. At other. Well, Waynetta promised to get her bangers out she for did, us. She did, yeah. Yeah, so we want to see so Waynetta's that, bangers. Yeah, that was on Twitter. Yeah. Facebook, uh, whichever one it was. Nigel says, uh, what brand of whiskey are you drinking? This, Glenmorangie. He said it right as well. Glenmorangie. Glenmorangie. Trim and fit, he keeps telling he, Trim? I think he's got a thing for you. If you want to meet him, he goes down to co-op nearly every day, don't you? Yeah. I do. You can have a bit of a feel down by tradesman's entrance. <laughs> yeah. James, um, we get fireworks for weeks <coughs> in Manchester. Yeah, I feel sorry for the I feel sorry for the animals. I saw again on reels. Uh, I saw a re I'm not advertising for Instagram, honestly. 
uh, there was a, a reel from a, a guy who you've probably seen it if you watch reels. He, he says he's just moved out of Birmingham and it showed you an apartment block and it showed you these kids just firing fireworks at this apartment block. And it was like, no, I'd be way out of there. Uh, our bestest mate is. Our bestest mate, Vanessa uh, Highland us. Rover. A little something for what you need around the croft. I think Cadbury's chocolate fingers. I think that's what we actually need for around the croft. Yeah. I think we do. Yeah, for energy to do things around the croft. We'll get some for when she comes round for a coffee. She Where's... keeps saying she's coming round for a coffee. Never gets here. Where's the best place you've ever... She falls asleep. Where's the best place you've ever hidden a chocolate finger? <laughs> I haven't. I have, behind the bread. <laughs> I hid them behind the bread once. It was a family box as well. Wasn't it? Uh, get well, round here for a coffee. Not now. We're a bit busy now. <laughs> but later. Uh, Captain Gary Phillips, hello. Oh, are you sober? Not seen you for a while. We haven't. Looking good in your T-shirt. Thank you. I think he means you. Though. I hope you and Nikki are okay. Uh, Lily and Noah say hello. Hello, hello. Lily and Noah and Nikki. And Gary. Looking good in my T-shirt. I bet he's on his sixth pint. Six? Yeah. Well, he'll have six pints on that side and six pints on that side. You've watched his videos? Yeah. <laughs> we think Gary's ace. It's fab. We think Gary's ace. And it'll always remind me of that night with Alan. That were hilarious. On Forgo narrow boating. Uh, Carol Smith. Yes, I watched your vlog. They are solitary. Great vlog, Sean and Colin. They are solitary animals. Thank you for Birds. thank you for spelling Sean right. Nikki B, you are you two are sweet. I thought I thought that said you are too sweet then. Oh, uh, oh here we go. Gently minge. <laughs> what? Brilliant. It is, isn't it? I Absolutely wish we, brilliant. I wish we could get away with something like that. Sorry, I am late. Hello. Hello. Hello, the minge. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy Ro is that now nah, is that Roch or <coughs> Rocha or Roche? I just said Roche. Yeah, like Ferrero. Yeah. Covered Could be. covered in chocolate and little knobbly bits underneath. Colin is like Benjamin Button, he looks younger every year. <laughs> Shall I show you what happens if I turn this light off? <laughs> <laughs> uh you <laughs> Uh, Pandajit says, you're perfectly safe as I am thousands of miles away. <laughs> uh, I know there is nothing to be done, but the ads are horrid. Well, you, there's no point in moaning at us. You're going to have to moan to YouTube or, or just don't watch. The, 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 now, calm me down, because I can, I can feel... That I've got, a, I can feel it coming. Don't shout at her. I, I'm not going to shout. I'm going to be pleasant, like I was to that woman in Lidl. <laughs> <laughs> I know she still cried, but she still cried. The thing is, the thing, the what? Now stop. If I go too far, so in fact, get hold of my finger just in case. So if I go too far, just give me a squeeze, and I know I've no, not like that, because you'll break it again. All right, so just squeeze it if I go too far. But what really pisses me off <laughs> is that he's squeezing like mad. Is that we do all this content and the moan, and we sit here asking about, don't we? I mean, we enjoy it, we do love it. We but, do. But it would be nice if we could just get a little bit of something for it. We do like doing, it, and we'd probably do it for nothing if we could, if we had to do it for nothing, yeah. wouldn't we? But it would be nice if we could just make a little bit just to keep us and and the animals and stuff going. So if we put an advert on, or if YouTube put an advert on every half an hour or so, I don't think that's bad. I don't. And and I know it's it's a bit inconvenient for some people, but what? life's shit sometimes, isn't it? And you just I think have to Yeah. Next. It's like if you are watching Coronation Not Street. Next. If you are watching Coronation Street or Hollyoaks or whatever, how many adverts do you get every half an hour? You get three, don't three you? Lots. So there you go. That's all I'm saying anyway. But there you go. Uh, Clive Davis says, careful with those chocolate fingers. You see, you can see from how I'm sat that it's uncomfortable. <clears throat> I think Vanessa's saying the same. Don't don't ever eat chocolate fingers when you're around at her house. 
You know my first boyfriend were called Michael Marsbar, don't you? Yes, we know. We've told you that story, We've told haven't that we? story. Okay. We're not telling it again. Uh, hi, guys. Were you paddy instructors? We were. Go on, Sean. Yes, we it. were. We were paddy instructors in the Maldives. Uh, we loved our time there. Is that it? That's it. There's nothing else to say. <laughs> yeah. We were diving in paradise. K karaoke Blocky, what do you use for your design work, Colin? We've got two dislikes after my little rant. Uh, what do you use for your design work, Colin? Your designs always look amazing. Uh, you use just Photoshop. My head, in it. Adobe Photoshop you use, don't you? Uh, Although that may stop. Oh, no, because I'm using the other one now. I'm using proper Photoshop now. Uh, mostly my head. I just have an idea of what I think something should look like, and then yeah. I just create the thing that's in my head. Most of the stuff is stuff on fire, isn't it? On <laughs> fire? It is, though, isn't it? It involves a match. Uh, Vinny says that's not his finger. Uh, Steve Grubb's getting no ads because you're a good boy. <laughs> what am I missing? <laughs> uh, Alistair says, uh, Colin, I came across some swizzle sweets. It's obscene, isn't it? Oh, on Amazon. And my dad and I was wondering if you would like some. Oh, no, it's just too much sugar. Oh, it's just sh pure it, sugar. It is just too much sugar. Uh, oh, look at this. Simon and Sean equals love. There you go. You've you've got a you got a new fella there. Really? Yeah. Get you out of my air for a while. <laughs> He'll come running back. Don't worry. <laughs> I've heard about that Simon. You know. Oh, poor Simon. <laughs> uh, that's the thumbnail, by the way. That. Uh, Timothy Kobe. I can just imagine Otis and Ollie sitting downstairs in the studio and broadcasting on Doggy Radio. I think he's been Strange. eating his wife's lipstick again, yeah. that one, hasn't he? You've been drinking your bong water. Uh, Tom Applegate, hello from myself and Laura and our little one, Darcy. Our honey arrived and it's beautiful. Thank you so much. You two always make me and my partner laugh so hard. <laughs> Hope you are both well, naughty boys. We, we are, are well. Thank you. Adverts are a part of life. Get over it, yes, says Rhonda. correct, Rhonda. Yes. Uh, although, uh, is that Ray or Ray? Ray? Right. Rachel, Rachel, I get it. You see, not had any adverts on our. Well, <laughs> I don't think they put adverts on in Nottingham, do they? Because no, they don't. They, they don't buy they, anything they in Nottingham. <laughs> so tight ass that you won't go out and spend your money. <laughs> Karaoke blokey will watch the adverts. Every little helps. It certainly it does. Certainly does. Thank you. Uh, Saturday morning, cup of coffee and foxes afloat. Brilliant. There you go. Kiwi, obviously, in New Zealand. Yeah. Uh, Bradley, I, Sean and Colin, I hope you're both doing well. Uh, content always makes me laugh. Oh, look, our friends are on. Fab, 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 Chris and Mary down. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, like from the peaks. <laughs> Hello, you two. Hi, Princess Script. Oh, dear. Uh... Uh, candy talk, making me think of that time you cruised past the candy factory on silver. That's what he's talking about. That's what he's talking about. Swizzles factory on the Peak Forest Canal. Yep, that's the same place. Yes. Lucinda Margulis. Uh Thank you for the super chat. Fabulous Lucinda. to see you two. Great job. Awesome. On, great job on Sherlock's home. Thank you. This man is... I pray, don't I? I pray to you no, on you my don't. knees. No, you don't. Here we go now with all the Colin bashing. Elizabeth Walton, does Sean do all the cooking or do you do any Colin? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I do all the cooking. Why? Why? Because Colin can't cook. When, when I'm away, see my sister or anywhere, I get photos and a question. Where do, I turn, where do I turn this knob on the oven to turn it on? Is this the knob? What temperature do I put it at? Where's the oven? <laughs> I do. have, you done, have you finished eating now? That's what, it, that's what it is. Is it this knob? Which section is it? Where do I turn it? Any plans on making your own alcohol drink? No. Sorry, Raheem, no. He's a, he might have. What are you thinking of making? 
Uh, I keep wanting to make it. I keep wanting to brew beer and wine. Oh, uh, well, yeah. But I never get around to it. I've always had too much to do. Hooch. Hooch. Let's call it Hooch. Fox's <laughs> Hooch. Fox's Hooch. That'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? We'll have to, we'll have to sell it on the dark web. <laughs> It's not too bad, Lorraine. Yeah. It's getting better slowly. It's getting better Jesus slowly. Christ, it's like pulling teeth, isn't it? Well, what can I say? Ebene oh, Ebenezer. It's like that song, innit? Ebenezer. Easy good. good. Easy good. Oh. We're not allowed to play that on radio anymore because it's. What up? No, it references drugs. Oh, right. Didn't know that. Uh, best wishes from further south in Scotland. Well, everywhere is further south in Scotland <laughs> from us, really, isn't it? <laughs> yes. I don't think we've ever met anybody that lives north of us, have we? Yeah, we've got a couple of viewers from Thurso. Have we? Yeah. We saw, I saw a lovely place on uh, Right Move. Not that we're looking for a new house or anything. Uh, and it was right on the front. If if you're watching in Thurso, you'll know what I mean. It's a six-bedroom house. And it's literally on the front. Is it really? And it looks out. And I thought, oh, naturist bed and breakfast. That would have been perfect. In Thurso? Yeah. Naturist? Yeah. Turn eating up. Way too cold. Turn eating up. Uh, Margaret Evelyn's just had our honey on toast. It was delicious. Thank Glad you. you like it, Margaret. Thank you. I've not had any bad reports about it. We yet, haven't, have we? no. Uh, Timothy Corby says, I'm in Nottingham and I've had advert. Ah, but you're in the posh bit. <laughs> Isn't he? They'll know you spend money. Yeah. They're in the posh bit. Uh, Jane says, watching Sean build that muse, I kept on thinking, Sean is the man. I'm the man. The man. Mm. I wouldn't do it again. <laughs> it would hard work. Does he mean like the man between us or like the man? The man. Good, because we know the other one's bollocks. <laughs> Princess script. Hi, foxes from Queensland from Australia. This weather is crazy here. We need lots of rain here. Super dry here. Super dry here too, actually. Yeah. There well, we go. not outside. I don't we'll get paid. We'll swap you for a little bit. I don't get paid for that, by the we'll way. We'll have some of your son. You have some of our rain. Mm. Uh, Emma Claire Isherwood says, uh, "Are you any relation to Christopher?" Uh, good to see you both. Thanks for making me laugh. Love to Otis and Ollie. Oh, I like your picture. Yes, yeah, quite a good. That's quite a good picture. Mm. Uh, Struth Ruth says, uh, "I do all the cooking in our house too, but it's because I love it and I wouldn't have it any other way." Yeah, I'm the same. Yeah, I'm the same. Bollocks. Although I'll say, Bollocks. what do you want for dinner? Oh, anything. Uh, do you want lasagna? No. Do you want fish? No. Do you want chicken? No. What do you want for dinner? Anything. <laughs> I love to love, but my baby just loves to dance, wants to dance. Is that what's playing? Yeah. Oh, I love to dance. <laughs> Have you finished yet? But you know it's true. I can't hear a word that's you going on. You can. What? Yes. Hello? Have you finished? Mm. <laughs> ah, dear. <laughs> he knows I'm right. Right. Tell you what we'll do next week. What? I'll do cooking and you can write, film, produce, publish, edit all the vlogs. I'm not complaining about cooking. You are. Everybody's, no, I'm not complaining about cooking. Everybody's having a go at I am not complaining about cooking but at all. You built the muse. You do all the cooking. I do call. See, he, he always takes it the wrong way. Always. Come on, do a super chat. Sharon Bamba, for some small mammals for your lad raptor. That's the best euphemism I've read all night. It's not a euphemism. You could not write a better double entendre than that. A small mammal for my lad raptor. In it, it's like saying my 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 large mammal eats mice. See, Sharon, all you've done is put something simple there and been generous, and he turns it filthy. It's got me going, is that? Come on. Where, where are we? Sure up a minute. That's all right. I just somebody mentioned the buzz, so I'm looking. Uh, Ryan, what sweet are you eating, Colin? Uh, it's it's a cheap version of Lindor. No, he's been eating Lindor. 
Lindor. It's not a cheap version Lindor. of Lindor. He wouldn't buy a cheap version of him, Lindor. Never mind, he cheat. <laughs> Uh, only one advert in New... Well, we know why. Hey, eh? New Mills. Yeah. <laughs> I do miss New Mills. I do. It's a lovely place. We were, it's not going to happen, but we were talking about getting, like, uh, a van. Not like a camper van. Just not something that we'd sleep in, something that we'd travel in, but something yeah. quite big and comfortable. So that the dogs could come with us. And uh, we, were, we were talking about doing that and go into certain places that we really love. So they'd be like Liverpool, because we really love Liverpool. Yeah, stopping in an Airbnb and stuff uh, like that. New Mills was there. New Mills was on the list. And Leeds, because it's like our home and everything. Uh, it would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would. It would be nice, that. Is Ebenezer related to Ebenezer Scrooge? No. Ebenezer Scrooge was like a tight old man, wasn't he? That was... Well, they all know the Christmas Carol. Not Nobbin Bob Cratchit. Robin, Robin, but well, you know what I mean. <laughs> Ebenezer Good was basically a drug dealer, wasn't he? Yes. Yeah, so we're not, we're not going to talk about that. Or a naturist camper van stopover. Well, I'd, I'd love to do something like that. Sean's not so keen. No, I'm not. Because he doesn't get it. He doesn't get the thing. It's not okay. that I'm a bit conscious, self-conscious. Aren't I? What about you, huge mammal? Wish. Yeah, I think it's it's like a pipe dream. I don't think it never happened, to be honest. Loving the holy the honey coloured t shirt, Colin. Thank you, thank you. I don't wear this that much, do I? I think no, I've, you only, don't, no. I've only worn it once on a boat, and I don't know why. Because I like people ask why I like super dry, and I like their cotton. Feel my cotton. No, stroke me cotton. <laughs> <laughs> stroke it. See what I mean? You you don't you can't even sense it, can you? Stroke your own cotton and then stroke my. Yeah, cotton. I know that's softer than this. Yeah, and it's just I have a thing. I have an issue with like fabrics, uh, and the cotton that Superdry uses, which is why he's a naturist as well, because um, he likes to be free. The 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 the, the, the cotton that Superdry uses feels really. I, I feels feels really nice, and I like feeling myself up while I'm wearing it. So. Uh, ah, but when I see the beautifully crafted vlogs, I definitely always think that Colin is the man. Now you see, yeah, sloppy seconds, isn't it? It's this. No, it's not. It is. It's like, oh, we've we've upset Colin. We we need no, to make him not. feel better now. You don't. I know James doesn't mean that. <laughs> we know that James is he's winding you up. <laughs> uh, Marjorie Johnson says, Colin, I hope your chocolates are as good as the ones I am eating. Lindor chocolate truffles. Yes. Oh. Now, I don't know where I will look in then, because you're up there, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, lovely. What? What? Uh, Nikki B says the fireworks are still going off and our two cats are snoozing. Yeah, he doesn't really... Yeah, I've noticed it doesn't tend to bother cats that much. It's mainly dogs, isn't it? Yeah. Jeff asking if we've got a bed bug problem up here in Scotland. No, the, it's going mental, isn't it, down south? Is it really? Yeah, it, really? Start, it started in France. Uh, and apparently it's in London, and there's again. I've, I've seen them on the tube. Yeah, well, yeah, I've I've been seeing that. Well, not personally, but I've seen videos of it. It makes me think, does that? Making me itch. It now. does. It does. It makes me think, cause like bed bugs live in beds, don't they? No. They do. No. They do. When you see them in Paris, that it's all the beds, in yeah. the in the hotels and that. So if bed bugs live in beds, where do cockroaches live? Next. Right, don't it? It's a legitimate question. Uh, Simon wants you to run away with him. Really? Mm -hmm. There's a bus in 20 minutes, if you want to be off. There's no buses at this time of night. There's no buses at any time here. We, we get four buses a week. <laughs> uh, Elizabeth says, I did actually cook tight as my Simon is put. Is she drinking? I think she's been she smoking made something. egg and chips and he's still alive. <laughs> well, I don't like egg and chips, do I? <laughs> I do. I love egg and chips. You, uh, yeah, I know you do. Do you know what my dad used to eat? Food? Just thinking of egg. He used to what? grate a load of cheese on a plate, crack uh, an egg in the middle and put it in the oven. And then add some bread and butter with it. He my, did. Mo says, my he husband wants me to have a good game of what's in his hand later. Uh, 
Mike, I do all the cooking in our house, but I haven't made anything yet from the Natural Harvest Cookbook. I don't understand. That is ruder than the last one. I don't understand. Uh, the Natural Harvest Cookbook is... Uh, it's... It's a cookbook with ingredients uh, of a certain bodily fluid. Oh, you can Google it yourself. Natural Harvest Cook. Don't Google it, people. I'm going to get rid of that. That's terrible. Uh, Raheem says, I love your humour and banter that you two have together. <laughs> it's all an act. We don't talk to each other at all, do we, outside of this office? Yeah, we do. <laughs> Watch his face when he sees where it is. <laughs> you, do, you have you spelt it right? Yeah, I'm just. It's... <gasps> <laughs> there you were talking about what you can get me for Christmas. Panama Rose. Says, love all your videos. The best in Southern California. Oh, we have been to California for ages, have we? Oh, must be twenty years. Must be. Thank you for that. Thank you yes, so thank much. You. Thank you so much yeah. for that. We yeah, about twenty years since we've been to California. We're coming up to a thousand comments. Really? Just in this video. Wow, that is a super amazing, isn't it? Uh, right. My mum used to do that when you loved it. My cousin. Do. Do what? Uh, right, I'm trying to find out where I was. Uh, buh, 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 buh. <sighs> Every time I do a super chat mention, it just throws us off. Foxes in a van. It's got a ring to it, hasn't it? No. Chris and Mary says, if you do, come and see us. We would, Mary. We would, Chris and Mary, we would. Nobbing Bob Cratchit. <laughs> That's what we should call this vlog, isn't it? <laughs> Nobbing Bob Cratchit. Uh, sorry, Chris and Mary. Yes, we would. Definitely. Mm -hmm. uh, would you go down the south of England? Well, everywhere's south for us, isn't it, at the moment? <laughs> yeah. New Newcastle. Yeah, Newcastle. Newcastle's south of England south. to us. Oh, dear. Uh, super dry make good. They do, but I think they do, yeah. Yeah, they do, actually. Uh, here we go. He's after you again, those muscular tanned arms. Will you Who needs stop a new it, man? <laughs> oh, we're going to have to set a fan club up for sure, aren't we? Shh. Stop it, yeah. you're making me blush. Yeah. Showing a bit of elbow and your ankles. Get you making in your shorts. Me blush. Well, Pandajit likes his muscular tanned arms. Uh, Marjorie would rather be eating your lasagna. <laughs> <laughs> I make a nice lasagna, don't I? Yes, you do. Uh, Vinny says, Simon has got bad knees, he can't run anywhere. That's, that's actually right, is that? Same, yeah. That's right. Oh, dear. Alistair says there's a super dry shop at the Gretna Gateway. Well, there's one in Inverness. Gretna Gateway in Gretna. is like hundreds of miles away for us, isn't it? It's a five-hour drive. Yeah, it's about 300 miles away. Uh, Jacqueline Jones says it's our 35 wedding anniversary uh, today. How many years have you both been married? Oh. Well... <sighs> Well, we've been together. Actually, this month, we've been together 31 years. Yeah, but we don't count that as our anniversary. We got together 31 years ago this month. Yeah. Uh, but the date we class as our kind of anniversary is the date that we moved in together, which is in June, isn't it? June. So next June, it will be 31 years. But the marriage thing, it was a bit weird here because to start at where you couldn't get married, then they did these things called civil partnerships, which we did... I yeah. think back in 2006. And then the change six. you could get married and you could change your civil partnership to a marriage. Yeah. Which we did. Which we did. But we class, but we got married and got our civil partnership on our anniversary date, which is in yeah. June. So we always class that date as our anniversary. Uh, congratulations on yours, by the way. Uh, Tim Horton, want Ian Vicar or Dibley? Uh, wondering a bit late. Well, I hope yes, you, I where hope, have you been? I hope you've brought a note and a packet of yeah. chocolate fingers. I hope you're drunk. And a flannel. <laughs> uh, Christina Treiber from Germany. Hello. 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 Uh, 
Uh, the original Alana says, I from Ohio on the shores of Lake Erie. Uh, we fall back tonight. Daylight saving times at Eastern Standard Time. We did time. last week. Do you, let me finish the frigging Sorry. question. He says, you don't speak enough. And then I speak. And it... No, you don't speak enough. And then you just talk over because you pissed. Because you've, not... had, you've had three pints of cider. You've had half a bottle of Glenmorangie. Do you have seasonal time changes there? Yes, we do. Just look, you know one finger does sod all to me now. Uh, yes, uh, BST we have, uh, which is British Summertime. Uh, and GMT, which is what we're on now. We actually did British GMT meantime. last weekend. So we go back, like you say, fall back. We don't say fall back. We just say, we say it properly, don't we? Put the clocks back. Put the clocks <laughs> My dad used to say fall back because a few years ago we tricked him, didn't we? Mm. <laughs> yeah. So now he uses the American term. Well, he did when he was alive. He used the American term fall back. Because we tricked him when the clocks went back, we told him they went forward. <laughs> so for a, for a whole day, he was two hours out. Do you remember? I do. It was funny. Judith D Todd has just Googled Nature's Harvest. Oh, you! he told you not to. I told you not to. Cheese and egg on a plate. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Your Sue. Yeah. It's lovely, isn't it? That's what he used to have, wasn't it? Yeah, that's what my that. dad used to have, yeah. Uh, Lorraine, Sean's looking very lean these days. Oh, what is it with these people? I, I, put your glasses on. I've got you on a filter. What you're looking at there isn't what they're no, you're seeing. Lying. What they're seeing is I've like shrunk it. No, you're lying. I am lying. <laughs> it's all the extracurricular activities, maybe. Uh, you don't even know what that means. I do. I do. do you? But I'm not doing that. I've not been doing anything lately since I hurt my knee. I've been just sat about, well, not just... wanting to use it. It's not that you haven't been doing anything. You can still lay there. <laughs> what, like you do? <laughs> See, that's going to go round his head now. Yeah. yeah. And he's going to think I was serious. Yeah, that's going to upset me. Is that one? <laughs> You see, what I don't get is that even though we live in the middle of nowhere, you still tell me to quieten it down. So how can I just lay there? You don't make sense. I never sense. say that. You just like, I'm either laying there or I'm making too much noise. I never say that. Oh, we got some super chats. Mm -hmm. Dave Arundel. Night, night, boys. Night, David. He's off to bed. Wish David a good night. He's probably gone already. To yeah, he's probably gone. Because we'd, we'd just ruffling that. Oh, it didn't jump that time. No, it didn't. That's good, isn't it? Uh, right, let's see where... It, it has jumped a little bit, to be honest. It's jumped quite a lot. Let's see if we can... We're going to come down a little bit. Uh, oh, pardon me. And, and right, so... Uh, uh, Nikki B says, I think the title of this vlog should be Fanny's Muffin Nobbing Bob Cratchit. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Uh, Jennifer Sherwood says it seems strange you not mentioning Alfie Barlow tonight. I think it's the first love that I've seen live that I've seen without you mentioning him. Hope he's okay. I think it's strange that you completely missed the section where we talked about Alfie Barlow for about five minutes and, showed, photo up. and showed two photographs from him. So, <laughs> were you asleep? Lay off the baby sham, Jenny Love. <laughs> He's gone out. That's why he's not being mentioned since the first time. We did we did mention him right at the beginning we did, and we yeah. showed him some photos we showed some photos, but he's gone out and that's why he's not being mentioned. He's having a night out tonight. We have just got a red alert. We have. Look but it's cloudy. That. Yeah. For wow. Aurora. Is it cloudy though? Uh bear with. It's checking to see if it's cloudy. Yeah, it is. It's cloudy. Yeah, it's cloudy. We just got a red see. alert for the Northern Lights, yeah. which means... So the Northern Lights are up there at the moment. We can't see them because it's cloudy. I just want to see how how bad they are, how good they are. Just bear with me a sec. Bear with. Bear with. Oh, that's not good at oh, all. Ice. No, yeah, that's the, crap. The, the, you put your light on. Yeah. Yeah. They'll no. be there, but they won't be very strong. Yeah, we wouldn't have gone to that one anyway. No. Uh, Alistair Holes is laughing at something. Uh, Neil says, if I bought a van, I would call it Halen. Yeah. <sighs> Hail and uh, Van. What not to do is going to Superdry in Inverness tomorrow. Or you might see us there if we were going to Inverness. But we're not, we're not going to Inverness. There you go. Uh, Joe Brown says, any photos of your wedding? There aren't. No. 
because we didn't have a wedding. Well, we did have a wedding. It was just the service. It wasn't a, an actual wedding. It was just us two and... And two witnesses. Two witnesses, which were your mum and my dad, wasn't it? Yeah, that was it. That was it. That was it. It was just... The we didn't want to fuss. I didn't want to fuss because I don't, I don't like the you fuss. You don't do it, do you? Although I would. But now he wants to get married again I in wanna, the castle. I want to get married. And you can Google this. I mean, don't, don't Google Nature's Harvest book recipes, but you can Google Ardross Castle. at r d r o s s castle To give you a clue of where Ardross Castle is... It's in Ardross. Or what it is... It's in a in castle in Ardross. Ardross, yeah. Uh, it's on the TV... It's what they use in the TV programme, Traitors. It's not far from us. It's only about half uh, an hour. Yeah, it's only about half an hour's drive. It's about half an hour away from us. And I want to get married there, and uh, like in k proper kills. And my my dream... You're going to laugh at... They're going to laugh at me. They're going to... Don't laugh at me. But my dream is to is to have a wedding, a proper like full blown wedding there, and all you lot be there. I mean, you'd have to pay to get yourselves off. No, I don't know. <laughs> you'd have to pay to get yourselves off there. Do you know what I mean? To get themselves here. Yeah, not get yourself off during the ceremony, but you'd have to pay to get yourselves Just there. Keep, keep digging, Colin. Go on, keep I'm, digging. I'm trying to put it right, but yeah, I think that'd be ace, wouldn't it? It would. Yeah. God, can you imagine all these like we could. There won't be enough room. I don't know. It's a big place, isn't it? I'm biting my lip now because I'm nervous. Alfie's on! <laughs> Alfie! I lasted an hour and a half at the pub and now sat in the corner watching you all. We were just talking about you. People... Alfie, you've got to watch. You're going to have to watch this back, mate. Because people you are were actually. At the beginning. People are actually complaining that we're not mentioning you. <laughs> And we did mention you. <laughs> we put a photo up of you in the t-shirt in the co colon and Shane shirt. So you've got to, you've got to, yep, yeah, you've got to have a watch back. I put it up again. I think I've still got it here. There you go. Look, it's not working for some reason. Oh yeah, there you go. There. there you go. There he is, mate. There's Alfie. And I think we've actually got your honey as well. There we go. Look, it's all about Alfie. We got, that could be a segment on the vlog, couldn't it? It's all about Alfie. Yeah, all about <laughs> Alfie. Well, if he came up here and did some work for us, it would be all about Alfie. But you got yourself all tarted up, mate, for nothing, for an hour and a half. I've got a piece of loose skin. He's still in the pub, he's sat in the corner. Watching our stream. Oh, right, okay then. <laughs> Dear me. Uh, right, sh karaoke bloke, he says, Sean's his Justin Bieber. What is it with these people? Are they daft? I told you. you are they blind? You underestimate yourself. Stop it. Oh. There's definitely a market for geriatric bears, I tell you. <laughs> I'm not a bear. I'm not hairy. <laughs> uh, is there... Lie there, think of England, not Scotland. Eh? Hey? When she's on about us laying there, because we're quite a little bit behind now. All right. Mm. Okay. Uh, Colin, on the other hand, is looking equally dishy. In that. No, I'm, I'm not having this. It's, it's it, No. If, if you, <laughs> you see... Do you see what you get when you mention me first? You, you upset him. <laughs> I, I am getting a bit pissed off. I might go sit under desk for a little bit. Stop it. There you go. Every, everybody's talking about Alfie now. What's that but problem? Every, everybody's back. talking about Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> Alfie's back now, look. Here we go. Everybody loves Alfie. Uh, Kitty Cat says, do you have the Aurora on a frequent basis where you are? Yes, we do. Uh, yes, actually, we do. But uh, the auroras are getting more frequent. There's like a lot of activity, isn't there? Mm. Uh, so, but yeah, uh, but it's it's generally cloudy. I would say yeah. more than half of the times when the aurora. Well, <sighs> long story short, we can get a because uh, there's like green, yellow, amber, and red warnings. Not warnings, but levels. Uh, but then there's this other thing called the ovation, which is what we look at, and that. Ovation. That, uh, ovation, and that gives us a better idea of whether we'll actually see anything or not. So for every... Uh, for, for, for the green, we don't see anything. For the yellow, we generally don't see anything. For the amber, we might see the green hues of the Northern Lights. We, I only go out to photograph it if it's red now. And even then, sometimes the red, the ovation is not very strong. And sometimes when it's red... The, the ovation can be so strong you can see it in the south of England. Yeah. 
uh, and it, and then it might be cloudy. So it's it's yeah. for every kind of every ten red alerts you get, we might see two of them. Yeah, might we? Yeah, because of the clouds. Yeah, if it's cloudy, you you don't stand a chance. Uh, Amber alert down in Tain. Yeah, this uh, Paul Jones got the red alert too. I've just looked at the ovation and there's nothing, and it's yeah. cloudy anyway, so we wouldn't go. Uh, Raheem says, "How frequent are they?" I would say, I mean, you can only really see them autumn, late autumn, winter, and early spring, can't yeah. you? Because then the it's summer, too light. We don't have a chance. It's too light. Uh, yeah. I would say, if it wasn't if it wasn't cloudy, we could probably see them at least once a month. If mm. it wasn't cloudy, but it is. I think last winter we probably saw them about half a dozen times, didn't we? Yeah, it's usually yeah, mm. uh, yeah. Steve Grubb, guess what we're doing tomorrow? Washing your nets. <laughs> it's going to be sat at home waiting for his honey. <laughs> it's, not, I'm not, it's, it's not even been posted until Monday. <laughs> uh, Lorraine Birch, I wear glasses, Sean. As Colin said, there's plenty you can do even with a gammy knee. He can use his gammy knee. Would you go native with your kilts? Absolutely. Mm. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, I'll bring the rings in the aisle. That'll be fun, won't it? Uh, ooh, that's a fancy castle. Traitor season two. I, I loved that. Pe oh, is it back soon? Here we go. It's all about Alfie. People miss me. Yeah, they do, mate. They Alistair. Do, mate. Hello, Alfie. Alfie, you've got to get up here and get on a vlog, mate. Nikki. Yay, Alfie. Hello. You've got to come up. Nikki. Uh, Catherine, we've missed you, Alfie. <laughs> oh, dear me. Uh, Chris Flynn, you've been mentioning the kilts for what seems like years now. We've still not seen them. Well, there's been posts on social media with them. Yeah. Uh, it, they were in a vlog Yeah. not so long ago. It was a dream sequence. It was a dream sequence and we, we weren't wearing them properly. Uh, I think it was the... Was it the... It was the uh, Waggle Dance vlog. Yes. It was a dream sequence in the Waggle Dance vlog. Yes. So there you go. Go back and you'll see them in there. <laughs> Oh dear, Maud's blushing well tonight. <laughs> uh, Michael and Colin, there you go. Look, there's somebody actually likes me. <laughs> I love you both, but Sean is so good with his wood, it's hard not to love him. <laughs> oh, Reba Skins. Uh, another one for Colin. He, uh, she'll join my fan club. Thank you. Oh, no bagpipes, Philip. No. Absolutely no bagpipes. <laughs> uh, naked blonde boy on a harp, if, if that's all right. Huh? Yeah, with wings. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's it all about, Alfie? I don't know where you got that idea from. Where? Where? 54. Actually, no. No, no. Because that happens on there, doesn't it? Although that would be a bit young. Mm. No, it was a video on Bellamy. <laughs> uh, Michael Howard's going to Iceland on Thursday. Hopes to see that. Good luck with that. Good luck. You need clear skies. Mm. Uh, Gene White, hi there. I live where you used to have Silver Fox made. I passed there today. Do you think you will ever live on the waterways again? No. I don't no. I don't think we will. Never no, we won't. Never say never, but I don't think we will. Uh, Carl, I'd take you off Colin any day, Sean. I'd take you off Colin any day, Sean. Oh, yes, yeah, so another one for you. There you go, you see? Uh, Aidan Williams says the sun is at a maximum at the moment. It's on an 11 year cycle, which is why there is so much aurora. Ah, right. Didn't know that. Ice cold in Alex. Why did you allow the dogs in your kitchen when you were sterilizing your honey equipment? Well, we didn't. Uh, so I have no idea where you got that from. Uh, just had a look. No aurora tonight in Tain. Shame. Wanted to get a photo. Not got a photo yeah, since it's cloudy, April. Isn't it? To be honest, you will not have got a photo since April because it's too light. But you will, honestly, you will get to see them. Just uh, look. Just find somewhere now that you can get to within a few minutes. You might be lucky enough to Being actually. Insane, you're on the coast. You might be able, lucky enough that you live somewhere where you get a good view north. Uh, but a good on un, not uninterrupted, but where you can see north. Tell you where you can get some great photos of the aurora when they happen, and that is the mound. 
Yeah, that's still a bit far from it's, Tain, though, isn't it? It's, 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 it's 15, 20 it's, minutes. It's a 15 minute drive from Tain, but mm. the mound. Yeah. Uh, I'll be your wedding singer, says Karaoke Blokey. Not if you sound like karaoke. I want like a proper. <laughs> a, yeah, but look what he says afterwards. Thank goodness Alfie's back. <laughs> It's always nice to have Alfie Barlow on the live chat. He says, he's there, look. Yeah. I will 100% have to come up. You will, mate. Just tell us when and you can come up any time. <laughs> uh, don't forget your sporans. We've got sporans. We have got sporans. We're going to have to get... I don't want that kill. I want a proper kill. It's not going to happen. We don't Stop talking about it. Because we can't afford a big we, wedding. We can't afford it. I mean, the hotel, the, the, the castle is like 20 grand. So it's just... it's Yeah, we're not, it's not going to happen. Way out of our... It's never going to... We wouldn't even be able to afford, afford a wedding down at Travel Lodge, I don't think, would we? <laughs> With a KFC <laughs> banquet. No! Oh, a KFC <laughs> banquet. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we need an ice fountain with alcohol oozing out. Oh, yes. We do. How long would the ice last if there was alcohol in it oozing out? Yeah, but the thing is, do you know what would be best? As a fa You know the chocolate fountains? Mm. You, could either, you could have two. You could have one with Bailey's coming out and one with that new amaretto. Can I put my head in it? Yeah. Not that, that creamy amaretto? Not that head. <laughs> oh, look at that. Sandra Pemberton. See, you cheered him up now. Nikki B says, Crosby Beach near Liverpool has... No, because it's still 10 to 1 to you, bastard. Uh, Nikki B, Crosby Beach near Liverpool has some beautiful photos of the Aurora... From last year, yes. stunning. Yeah, it, there were a couple of times it was quite strong. You could see it way south. Is that where the, the men are? Or the men on beach? Or the statues? Yeah. I think so. I think so. Yeah, I think it is, isn't it? We've never been there, have we? No, we haven't. Uh, frugal Grandma will make a, a wedding cake. Ooh. Ooh. I've made our Christmas cake, by the way. Mm. I haven't iced it yet. Mm. But the Christmas cake's made and it's been fed with brandy. Uh, Pip Thompson says, uh, hey guys from Barcelona, do people in Scotland celebrate bonfire night in your experience? Yes, they do. Yes, they do, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. They're part of the, Scotland is part of the UK, so yes. Mm -hmm. uh, what not to do? All oh, right, I know who you are now. Jeez, yeah. You got, we showed you your honey photo earlier on. Uh, later this month, moving to Lock End, Lock Broom, six miles from Ullapool, we'll be facing all, so hopefully we'll see loads of auroras after moving. Yeah. Yeah, you will. Yeah. Let's crowdfund for the castle. I'm sure our <laughs> trolls will love a crowdfunder for Colin and Sean to get married. I'm, yeah. sh I'm sure they would love that. They hate... When we did the charity auction... I they mean, hated it. We, we were get, we, I mean, you saw, because I put the, the, the emails and the receipts up the next morning uh, where we'd given the, the £1,600 to charity. Yeah. And they hated it. Absolutely hated it. Uh, always begging for money and this and it's like yeah for charity would <laughs> man up and the, what was the other one uh, what was the other charity uh, man was, up uh, and prostate cancer prostate cancer UK yeah <clears throat> uh, that's what I think of them anyway now this is more like it Matthew Lee I don't understand all these people picking Colin or Sean the clear and correct answer is both at once you naughty naughty person our email <laughs> is fox. <laughs> <laughs> Ashley Bratton says, Hey, my mum and dad both love watching you. You are both amazing. My dad's birthday is Monday and he was wondering if you would give him a shout out. His name is Kev. Of course. Happy, Kev. Birthday, Happy for birthday for Monday. Happy birthday for Monday, Kev. Yay. Can Alfie join one of your lives sometime? Uh, we'll probably, if he, yeah. That's up to Alfie. It's up to Alfie if he wants to come up. We have a screen now let's see if I can get it we have a screen yeah where we could put him on so yeah that's working we yes. could do that if he wasn't here in person we could put him on yes uh, super chats for your wedding says Nick Werner well the problem with that is that YouTube take 30% of our super chats they do uh, we get hardly anything which I'm not allowed to say anything critical because they will take it all off us and stop us from doing them 
so we, we can't do it. We, we wouldn't be, we, I, I wouldn't feel right asking no. people to do that. I'd like to, but I'm not going to. No. Uh, hot chocolate is bad for your willy. Uh, is, ah. is that why you brew tea now, Lee? Is that like something from personal experience, do you think? Where did that statement come from? Because we were talking about putting my head in a chocolate fountain. Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> I'm thinking, where did that come from? Uh, speaking of Super Chats, Tom Whitman. Hi, Tom. Uh, I'm late, but still able to give the kids a little something. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Tom. That will buy them some treats. I thought I, I thought I had a lump under my arm, and it's actually a bit of cotton off my T-shirt. He's always looking for stuff that's wrong with him. Let's not go there tonight. <laughs> wow, a thousand and two comments. Wow. That is... It's bizarre. I nearly said spondylosis. That's what your dad had, wasn't it? <laughs> spondylosis. Uh, Jen Lee Minch says, Sean, if you are sitting around with a lot on your... Uh, if you are sitting around a lot with your knee... Well, you wouldn't, well, you wouldn't have left it in the bedroom, would you, or in a I cupboard? I wouldn't, know. Uh, why not write your own recipe book of the meals you cook? I could, but it's a lot of work. Thank you, Raheem. Raheem. Andrew Laycock says, <laughs> uh, love the photographs of the two dogs at the street. That was on Facebook. How long did it take? The two dogs at the street. Uh, love the photographs of the two dogs at the street. Let us check on that. I don't know if he means of this morning. I don't know. I don't know. We'll we'll come back to you on that. Oh yeah, Anthony Gormley's Iron Man. That's who it is at Formby Beach. Uh, Alistair Hall says, "Will you be having Justin Bieber as your guest of honor?" Well, I'll be having Justin Bieber, but we're not quite sure where yet, are we? No dogs of the Mont Street. No, we won't. He missed that one. Uh, Will you be having Justin Bieber as your guest of honor? And I says, "Well, we'll be having Justin Bieber." <laughs> He's a screamer, apparently. <laughs> no, it is from I'm what really? I read. Yeah, from what I read. Yeah, he's he's quite oh, right. from people in nearby hotel rooms. That yeah, he's quite a noisy one. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry, mama. <laughs> See, he's wondering, isn't he? <laughs> Dribbling. <laughs> Not from there, dear. Uh, Vinny, I live in Runcorn and love walking along the canals. Would you go back to Runcorn? We actually would. We actually loved it in Runcorn. Uh, we would go back to Runcorn. Yeah, it's nice. In, yeah. Friendly and people. And I'd like to see the progress because they're getting the funding, aren't they, to do the, Ooh, yes, uh, for the um, redo the link down to the Manchester yes, Ship Canal. So, connection down Yeah, there. we would definitely go back to Runcorn. Lots of nice people in Runcorn. Uh well, Jean White would buy that recipe book. I'm not sure if she's talking about the one you're writing or the Nature's Harvest one. But <laughs> <laughs> oh dear! Uh, it's Thomas, spelt like Thomas Schaffernacker. Thomas Schaffernacker. Yeah, so it's well, Thomas. Yeah. Thomas. Thomas. Not saying much. He's just very lovey and happy by the look of his yeah, emojis. He's, he's laughing a lot. He meant the dogs in the stream. Oh, right. It wasn't actually a stream. It was just a flooded footpath. Yeah. Uh, where we take them, it's like this massive open air. It's like old sand dunes, and 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 there's a word for it, isn't there? And I can't remember what it is. Uh, but there's lots of little paths everywhere, and they're all flooded yeah. because of the rain. It's a big nature reserve, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, part of it's because of the rain, but at one end, it's because the sea came right over the sand dunes uh, at the weekend. During storm, Kieron. Kieron, yeah. <laughs> Kieron, spelt yeah. with an A. Everybody saying he means stream. Uh, Tim Talks Theatre says, what about Sean Mendes, Colin? What about him? He's a singer, isn't he? He's a singer. He's a yeah. good-looking lad. Do you think? Yeah, I think he's oh, a good-looking lad. He's, no, he's, 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 no. no, I couldn't. I no, could, I couldn't. But I think I, he's a good-looking lad. I could lad. watch you with him, but I couldn't. See, he's... Hot chocolate is bad for your willy if you dip it in. I don't know. If, if, it's, not cold, if it's not hot, if it's just warm... Isn't it? I don't know. There might be something in the chocolate that does something to it. I don't know. Tom. Yeah. Uh, Go Ke clean your mind. Kay Thoop says, be beneath your soundproof room. <laughs> Maybe that's why I soundproofed it. Uh, I bought some of Sean's recipes years ago. 
Oh yeah, we've still. Oh we yeah, had we did some on the website, didn't I we? I forgot we did them on Patreon. Yeah, we did them on Patreon. Your Christmas cake ones on Patreon as well, isn't it? It is. We should do. You should do that. You should make Sean's Christmas cake. It's it's lovely. There's half a bottle of brandy in it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it really is, isn't there? There really, it really is. Yeah. Uh, so Nancy Mantic says, "I'm so enjoying your live stream." For your information, that's what FYI means. FYI. Uh, we've got your live stream on the TV and on my phone. The ads are only playing on my phone and not the TV. Weird. That's weird. Well, it's not actually weird. It's because it comes from a different place. Does it? Yeah. Ah, right. There you go. There you go, you see. Uh, Mark Edmondson says, I live in Formby. No Iron Men, just Red Squirrels. Crosby Beach is just up the road. I think that's where we meet. That's where they mean, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Sandra will buy your cooking book. I need a lot of recipes to fill a book. Yeah, I, you haven't got... I'd end up doing it, wouldn't I? That's right, yeah. And I, I, could, yeah. I could write the recipes down, but he'd have to design and all that sort of stuff, wouldn't you? I'll tell you what we'll do. I heard that Narrowboat Chef's still got about four boxes of their books not sold. <laughs> what we could do is buy them off them really cheap and just put... And a recover new, them? Yeah, just put a new cover on. <laughs> and all the photos inside of... I can't remember his name. Where is it? Herbert. <laughs> Can't remember his name. Ryan. He Ryan. was called Ryan. What was she called? Ethel. <laughs> I can't remember her name. Lucy. <laughs> Ethel. I don't know. Patricia. Oh, what was she called? Lucy. I don't know. But what we could do is just like cut our heads and put stick our heads on their bodies. Um, that'd look. That'd work well, wouldn't it? Yeah. No. No. It'd still be cheaper and less time than actually writing his own book, though, wouldn't it? They were good at what they did. They, they are good. I think they're yeah. still doing it, aren't they? I, I, I think so, yes. Mm. Uh, diabetes is bad for you, Willie, so as long as you don't have enough hot chocolate to trigger that, you should be fine. There I, you go. You can get diabetes in your Willie. It's a thing. Is it a thing? Your Willie is a thing. Okay. Uh, he got the Christmas cake one, did Steve Grubb? It's nice, isn't it? It's Christmas cake. You do make a lovely Christmas cake. I do make a nice Christmas It's very cake. alcoholic. It is very alcoholic. Yeah, it would. In fact, I put half a brandy... In the mixture, well, I, I soak the fruit in half a bottle of brandy. Soak my fruit. <laughs> and then I used to buy a full bottle, so half a bottle goes in with the fruit and soaks for three days, and then I put more in, inject more in once it's cooked. Mm -hmm. Nikki B, what are your thoughts about Hugh Grant as an umpa lumpa in the new Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? I, I, I've actually seen that quick clip. And, and I haven't he, seen it. He quite, he quite suits it. I haven't seen you it. You have seen the clip where he's in a jar and Tim, Timothy, Timothy Chalamet is kind of looking down at him and he's in, this, and he's in a jar I and he starts seen that. dancing and he says, You can stop dancing now. He says, No, oh, I've started dancing now. And I haven't does seen dance. that. Have you not seen it? No. The movie's out next month. I, oh, I, is I it? really want to see it. Yeah, I do. Why do you like him as well? Who? T -t Tim, the, 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 the no, French lad. He's, no, no. He's it's a bit too, bony, he's isn't too, it? Yeah, it's too skinny. Yeah, he's a bit, but you can just imagine yeah. like his elbow digging he's into nice, your thigh. His face he? is nice looking, but no. Yeah. He's a nice looking bloke, but no. Mm. I know what you mean. Yeah. It's like, ooh. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's a nice looking lad, but no, the rest of him is it's too skinny. Pale Bubble says, hello, finally been a... You could give him some pies. Fatten him up a little bit, <laughs> couldn't you? Yeah, I could. Yeah. Uh, hello, finally. Hello, hello, finally been able to join one of these streams. Hope you guys are doing okay after the stop. We're f we're fine. fine. We keep having the occasional power cut, but we get on with it, don't we? We do. We get. Oh, there we go. Look, there we go. <laughs> uh, Struthruth says you could do a cooking pamphlet instead of a book. Or he, a leaflet. He can't say pamphlet, can you? Pamphlet. It's, yeah, no, it's like that other one, that grass that you can't Pam say. Pamphus. No, that's not what you usually call it. Pamphus grass. No, you usually call it. Is it's it pampus? Is it which the one I'm thinking of? Phallus. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like it, doesn't it? <laughs> Oh, my God. That's got a P and an H in it, hasn't it? Oh. Phallus grass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear me. 
<laughs> oh, that's a bit loud. Uh, Linda Whiteside says, uh, do you have any recipes using honey? Well, we've got no honey left, sweetheart. Well, we've got no, we've, we've got a jar for ourselves. Mm. But honey, uh, a lot of Chinese food with honey. Mm. Steve Grubb says, uh, Sean's recipe for basic cob has honey in it. Cob. Bread. Cob, yeah. Yeah, you were thinking of corn on the cob then, weren't you? No, I weren't, no. Yeah, I'm not doing that again. Uh, Alistair, oh, I don't know what he's laughing at. Uh, <laughs> Dave T says, after dipping your willy in melted chocolate, what happens when it hardens? What are these people smoking? I think you actually need to... In fact, I need to try it and see. But I don't know whether he's talking about whether when the chocolate hardens. Do you, uh, no, let's not go there, actually. You'd have to be hard to put it in and then have it. Do you know what I mean? That'd be how you can like make a chocolate willy, wouldn't it? Because you see chocolate willies advertised, don't you, in on, like, these cheap sites and like Amazon and that. I mean, ours would be a lot bigger, obviously, but... You know what I mean, don't you? We could make chocolate... That's what we could do. We could make chocolate willies. Yes. Is that... No. Okay, then. <laughs> You've lost out there, haven't you? You've lost out there. Uh, you two could be the new Chuckle Brothers. Well, I, you can be the dead one. <laughs> can I be the dead one? I'll be the one that's still alive. <laughs> <laughs> I think one's dead out there now. <laughs> Uh, Lumper says hello. <laughs> <laughs> you could be the dead one. <laughs> oh, you shouldn't laugh, but it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want a minute? Oh. Uh, uh, happy to hear you're doing okay, says Pale Bubble. Thank you. Uh, Vinny says, does Sean miss his Navy life on a big ship full of seamen? No. I like the pun, but no. <laughs> uh, Nancy says, a title for your cookbook. Well, it's a pamphlet at the moment, isn't it? A it's a leaflet. A phallus pamphlet. Just two-page leaflet. Uh, master, <laughs> two pages. Just a piece of A4 paper. <laughs> First page is Sean's recipe. <laughs> Front page is the cover. Second page second is an page advert. Is the index. No, second page is an advert for Narrowboat Life Unlocked. <laughs> third page. Third page is an advert for calendars. Oh, God bless the plastic. No, and uh, a fourth page can be a link to BBC Good Food. Oh. Oh, Can right. I say that word? No. Master in the <laughs> art... Right, title for your for your pamphlet. Master in the art of Scottish cooking or 101 things to do with a haggis. Throw well, in. I know three things to do with a haggis and one of them's throw in. <laughs> the other two, well, one of them you need a big roll of gaffer tape. Oh. And the other one I'm not mentioning at all. Oh, dear. Oh. I've got a headache now from laughing. Alistair Holes, which one would you play from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? Which one? Yeah. Me. I'd be Augustus Gloop. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'd be Willy Wonka. Yeah, probably. Yeah. I'd be Willy Wonka. Oh. Uh, next year, make mead. No, no mead. Right, three reasons why we're not making mead. It's alcoholic. We can't sell it. That's reason one. We're not allowed to make it because we can't do anything with it. And we won't drink it because we don't like it. Two, we don't have enough honey because you want to buy the honey. So we'd rather sell you the honey then waste it on making something that we're not going to drink and we're not allowed to sell. And I can't remember the third one, but it can't have been important. <laughs> uh, Derek says, my wife has just looked at Nature's Harvest book. She likes the look of the tarts. <laughs> oh, brilliant. <laughs> oh, oh, brilliant. You better get cracking then, Derek. Oh, dear me. You've got a lot of work to do, mate. <laughs> oh, dear me. <laughs> uh, Simon Till says, can you show the best picture from both calendars? Right, be careful. I will. Because you know what YouTube's like. I know like. what YouTube's like. Uh, let's have a look then. Oh, I don't know. I don't know what I think the best picture is. I, I think photographically, I think from a from a photography perspective, I think the best one is is Dunrobin Castle, 
because I just think it's a good photo. Because there's so much in it, I just think it's a good photo. It's not my favourite photo, but I think it's the best photo. Do I have to cover anything up on that? No, because it's not showing anything. And the, I think the best... Well, that's actually the front cover, isn't it? It's the front cover, and it's inside the calendar on Colin's Naked, Naked Fox calendar. Is that one. I can't see where it's going. Oops, sorry, people. Is that one. Yeah. Because... It's so artistic. It's so artistic. And I like, I can't show it, but I do like April. You could put your thumb over it. <laughs> Just make sure you put your thumb over it because YouTube will ban us. <laughs> oh, my back looks fat in that. I, don't. I have a bum in my middle back. Uh, haggis is good in lasagna, says RB. Really? Mm. You could try it, couldn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Jenny Sherwood says, can you do a live every Saturday night, please? No. <laughs> That's enough. That's enough. I know, I'm just them. trying to find the foot thing and put it back over there. Uh, well, I'm surprised nobody's asked this before now. Uh, Michael says, is Sean's Christmas cake as moist as Fanny's? <laughs> If you don't know what that means, go back about an hour. Oh dear, we better we better crack on. Look. Yeah, I know. Uh, it's nearly bedtime. I know. Oh, shouting in me oh, ear. Sorry. Uh, Lynn. Oh, sorry, Linda. Linda Whiteside. Super chat. Thank you. You two always make me smile. Thank you. Linda. I like it when we make people smile. I do. I yes. like it better when we make people's whole week. Don't you? You could make Simon's whole week by the sounds of it. Uh, is the other calendar still available to buy? They're both still in stock. We've got a few. We've got about a dozen yeah, it is Alpha, yeah. of each one left. Are you wanting one of those, mate? Uh, I would have loved to do a painting of the castle. Boo hoo, can't paint anymore. Oh, sorry. Oh, about dear. That. Uh, Raheem says, You two know how to make me laugh. <laughs> I love you both. Cheers, Raheem. Uh, Pale Bubble, they're both fabulous photos. Are the calendars still for sale? They yes. Uh, if you go to uh, foxesafloat.com forward slash calendars or for foxesafloat.com forward slash shop. Yeah, or I'll just, scan that. Or just scan that QR code and that will take you to the page where you can buy them. It will. <clears throat> there you go. So uh, Foxes Afloat dot com either forward slash shop or forward slash calendars or just go to foxesofloat.com and there'll be a link that says shop and you can get them from up there yes shall we give them a special little discount code really are you yeah. gonna put it up on screen i'm gonna i'm actually gonna you're gonna have to create it i'm first, gonna right? i'm yeah. gonna i'm gonna while we're doing it now i'm gonna create a discount code so if you want to buy uh, a calendar it's got it's Got to log into the shop first. If you want to buy a calendar or a photo book, I'm going to give you some discount. Uh, if you just bear with me one second. How long is this discount code going to last? It's going to last for 24 hours. There you go. Okay. Right, you're just going to have to bear with me one second because I'm actually going to have to create it. Uh, it's a good job he knows where this is because I wouldn't have a clue. <laughs> You've got to write discount now. Voucher. Shh. It's all right. They can't get into this bit of the website. I don't know. It might be screen sharing. They might be able to see it. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, because we can see what's going out, look. Yeah. Okay. See, now he's struggling because he's, he's panicking trying to find, I'm not, find it quickly. I'm not panicking at all. I'm just looking in the wrong place. There we go. There we go. Coupons. Right, so we need we need to name it. What can we name it? Um, uh, we need right. Uh, we need what's a funny word? I know what we'll use. <laughs> okay. Oh dear. Oh, are you giving that much? Yeah. Uh, da, 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 to each eligible It's been item. very generous. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Right. Okay. Sorted. 
Uh, is that saved? That is saved. Right, let me just get rid of that and you should be back. Right, okay, this is what I'm going to do for you. You've got to type, you've got to type. So somebody's going to love this. Okay, so foxesafloat.com forward slash calendars or forward slash shop. I'll just click the shop link, okay? And you will get, if you buy within the next 24 hours, 20% off all the calendars. All the books. And the new photo book. You'll get 20% off those. Uh, and also the adopting beehive stuff as well. Ooh, now there's a thing. So you'll get 20% off everything in that shop. Not our merchandise, so not like the clothing and stuff. No, because that's a different shop. Just the, fo the photo books and calendars and stuff. You'll get 20% off. At the end, where you check out, you have to enter a discount code. All right? And the discount code is... And you've got to write it in capital letters... I'm just going to put it on the screen because it's quite funny, I think. <laughs> Are you ready? The discount code is not there. Where is it? <laughs> Have you got to click the I? It's behind, it's behind the... Uh... It is there, isn't it? Right, let's get rid of the, uh, the calendars and it'll appear. Ta-da! <laughs> the discount code is Alfie. <laughs> If you use discount code Alfie in the next 24 hours, you will get 20% off each and every calendar and photo book, which you can see just behind me on the wall, uh, which is great for Christmas, isn't it? Yeah, good Christmas uh, present. We will ship that worldwide, so you can get that anywhere, anywhere and in the world. And they will go out on Monday. Yep, we will ship them out on Monday. Right. Uh, I will get one. <laughs> Alfie, I'll get one. <laughs> right, uh, we're going to have to start wrapping these up in a little bit. Are we? Yeah, yes. How long are we all right for? Another 10 minutes? Or do you want to get off? Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's finish. It's getting late. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's just have a look at these. Right, okay. So... Uh, foxesafloat.com in the shop calendars 20% off if you use that <laughs> discount code there he's going to love it isn't he he's going to love this <laughs> give Alfie a free one then he says oh dear right are we going to get off yes we're going to get off right thank you so much for joining us time's flown tonight it's, hasn't it? it's gone really fast tonight I was surprised when I looked at the clock and I thought oh my god it's 20 past now we've been on Nearly an hour and a two hour, two and a half hours. Yes. Uh, if you've joined us halfway through, you can go back after it's finished, and you'll be able to watch from the beginning again. You should be able to see the live chat as well uh, on on whichever side you're watching. Are you all right? Yeah, it's just hurting because okay. I've been sat down for two and a half hours. Not his knee. Yeah, it is my knee. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks so much for joining us. Uh, hopefully, we'll we'll have a vlog for you next Friday. Uh, there wasn't one yesterday. Uh, but hopefully there'll be one next Friday, and we'll do another live in uh, in a couple of weeks. Uh, I think <laughs> I think Alfie likes his discount code, don't you? <laughs> oh dear! Right, we're gonna go. So uh, you take care of yourselves. Uh, we'll hopefully see you next Friday. Uh, anything to add? Have a fantastic weekend. All right. See you later. Bye bye. Ta -ra.